A lady is a creature, a female, in other words. Islam is the only religion that respected a female within all its titles as a mother, as a sister, as a wife. Hmm? What else? Yeah. Any title that a female can ever have, Islam respected you in respect with that title. But now today we are in this era where maybe I would say we are being taken up by whatever is happening on earth today with claims that they are respecting the rights of a female. An example. Have you ever heard of feminism? What comes back into my mind whenever I hear the word feminism, and of course I'm an, I'm an academician, I know what it means. This is where a group of ladies being convinced that maybe they deserve some rights that they, they, or they are already missing. But then Islam, in this line, actually many of feminists normally invade islam and they are like islam is busy denying some rights of ladies of muslim ladies and if you're a muslim and you really think that islam is not doing you justice maybe you really need this session so at least we are to discuss how did islam respect a lady with all her titles eh? as a mother as a sister as a wife and we are going to exhaust all these titles inshallah may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us the ability to 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 make sure we understand this karam al islam al mar'ata umman islam respected a lady for the fact that she is a mother no religion on earth will ever respect a mother just like islam did let me even take you through what used to happen to ladies way back in jahiliya when i see when i see when i see a girl a muslim in particular claiming that islam is not doing them justice maybe because they think maybe whatever they think in in any way i'm like maybe they don't know what used to happen to women during jahiliya period a woman was considered a property in Jahiliya period. Not only Islamically, but even those who are historians here, you know the history of ladies way back. A lady was considered a property, and here we get a factor that even the fact that they are considered properties that's why men way back in history they used to have limitless numbers of ladies and what confuses me most is edda or maybe when a husband used to die and he is having wives all these wives ladies under this man were considered properties they inherit you just imagine eh? you're a wife of them to a man and then your husband dies and the family of the guy now inherits you as a property you were like that and it was fine for your own information and the third way was it was a kind of marriage 
where a lady was subjected to being exchanged between different men. Now, for example, my wife eh, with the wife of Ingenia Rajab. And then I'm like, oh, Ingenia Rajab, your wife is beautiful. And I think, let me have your wife for a week. And I, I give you my wife also for a week. And it was fine. For this wife to go there and maybe to enjoy her and maybe for me also to enjoy his wife. And it was fine. That's, that's the so-called Jahiliya period. And lastly, there lived a, a, a kind, kinds of ladies. They write on those doors and they are like, Yenaya Gala to make to deal with their desires biologically, of course. I don't want to be vulgar. Their desires just enter here. So these men, whoever was bypassing the house, nga ingida buyingizi, nga baite vezao, nga malafuruma, obaba sadja babidi, obaba sato obaba na. So the drama used to appear happen when it's time to figure out who is the father of the kid, just in case the lady is pregnant now. This baby is yours. Now it's a meeting, the whole village. All men to come. And if this lady was like, You are the father of this kid I'm carrying, to Wakubanga Kerere, the one in our DNA. So when Islam came in place, it really had to fix all that drama. To position a lady with respect in all her titles and the first title primarily a lady as a mother islam allah subhanahu wa ta'ala way back in the holy quran made it clear it's only islam that respects a lady before her becoming a mother even after her becoming a mother guess what even when a lady has no capability of becoming a mother islam even considers her respect Yes, and today, when a lady does is barren, society hmm, society blames that girl or maybe that lady just because maybe she's not giving birth. It's now becoming normal for a lady to think that maybe it's too bad. Maybe the society would have been having this kind of understanding and they are like okay maybe it's not yet her time maybe let's understand the fact that she can't give birth and the society is in line with blaming these young girls or maybe young ladies the society is like you girl what's your problem so islam is like no 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 we have to respect this lady before they become a mother as they become a mother and even if they are not granted that chance opportunity of becoming a mother allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the holy quran qala ta'ala wa wasayna al-insan bi walidayhi hamalatuhu ummuhu wahnan ala wahn allah was like we enjoined mankind to respect a mother considering whatever she went through in line or maybe before giving birth to you it's only in islam you know you know your ladies at least you know the difficulties a lady goes through when they are going to give birth yeah that's when you're going to okwero ndalonda in what you eat eh? some 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 ladies at times but you susana muko in their behaviors eh? this is a lady now and maybe when they are pregnant they don't need you as a husband around eh? when they are pregnant and it is okay eh? some when when a lady is now pregnant and of course all that drama stuff that happened eh? prepare your guy I, I know Kubanga, he is expecting all this drama now. So Allah is like, no, 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 no. With all these difficulties our mothers go through, females go through, ex experience 
as they are trying to put someone on earth, that alone is a factor. Those are factors worth considering if you need to respect this lady. And come on, if there is a man, mankind, any human being, that is not going to respect a female, in respect with that, and that's why Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, in an authentic tradition, when he was trying to guide the companions, one companion came, went to the Prophet and he was like, Ya Rasulallah, between, if, if, I, if I'm to compare the way I'm supposed to be kind and treat nice my father and my mother, who should I prioritize first? And then the Prophet was like, Ummuk, prioritize your mother once, twice and thrice. That's when the Prophet remembered us guys, fathers, on, on the fourth position. You know what that means? When a lady gives birth, she has a lot to do to make sure she's respected as a mom, to make sure she is respected and positioned to fit all these titles Islamically. And you know what is happening today? Ladies are giving birth and they think that just because they are giving birth to kids, it's just obvious and automatic that they deserve being loved thrice. No, logically, Prophet was trying to mean that after giving birth as a mother, you really have to give your son and daughter a reason to love you thrice as compared to the love they give their fathers. And we are living in a world where a kid, son and daughter, prioritizes a father over a mother. That will never be fine. Do we have a mother here? What are you? Do we have a mother here? Eh? Kale ngiri jatari woka kamfune ngiri jemba adresi inga mwe. Wallahi today, the world is being unfair to mothers. Just because a lady is giving birth to more than two kids, three kids, or maybe more than four kids, a church yoka, Nimufuna yo nobu 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 statement so obu bajirega ndi ozala anga kamyu lwa chite weba lirida. Isn't it? Really? No pride. A lady, a female will never be respected in a society okuja konga she is adding to the society by being a mother. Maybe if Allah granted them, maybe if Allah never granted them the ability, a chance, an opportunity of becoming a mother, that is understandable. But if you have the ability to put someone on earth as a mother, please, you will never be disrespected in front of Allah as a mother, just like the world is doing today. Just a few, a few months back, a lady approached me. She was having seven kids. And then she was like, the husband, just imagine, her husband is busy disrespecting her just because she is busy nurturing the seven kids, not working, and he is comparing this mother to seven kids to other wives he is having just because those wives are working, and this mother of seven is not working, even when she is a degree holder. And that's how bad the earth is today. Can you the feminist After 30 years from now, the lady you're trying to disrespect today just because she's having many kids, Wallahi Lazim, this is the same lady that is going to smile at you without any kid. Because today, young ladies are being convinced that Osebo Kola building their careers, having lots of money, maybe having a plaza in town, is far more important than the fact that she can nurture and add some values to some kids in society. You don't know how many ladies that are well off. They are having kids, one or two, they are in their late 50s. They are in their late 50s. A simple example. 
when someone is old in age the last thing they need is companionship your mother and your father who is above who is in 50s you're doing them a lot of injustice of not thinking of getting someone to get married to muzaleyo mwana such that one day your father your mother would order you as a daughter and they are like please we need someone to discuss with of course it might not be you because we will be having some other stuff to deal with but you will send in delegate your daughter and son to discuss with them because you won't be there and now your mother aliye yomchalo deep down in the village in a grass thatched house ali miaka nkaga bwakera na adaga down to the garden mbusimanya genze kola gulie no digida you're 30 years old you're not even thinking of maybe let me get someone i give birth when my kid is 6 7 years old once in a while i will send them back to the village for my dad and mom to feel the companionship that you won't give them even when you're old is that too hard to understand is that too hard to understand do you even know how like why in europe there are many nursing homes you're busy taking care of old ladies and old guys where are their grandkids these are the th same people abayingi the family planning <laughs> we have a girl simanyoba yegwalye who is 20 years old 25 years old not married yet but she's already having methods of family planning just in case waingiro bufumbo jaliyo bataliyo and if you see mukati abakola nursing nesma medical bichi joryeyo waziigadda do when i enter in marriage after giving my first kid birth to my first kid Allah said you're not even a C-section story. Allah said it's a normal delivery. No yingira will be method zawo. This method di bo jira boti. I say ko yon echa ankara na wo. I say many after no so no fugal mo mugumba for some two years. Just because you you uh, you having this background of family planning. No yingire miyaka jo 40 years old with two kids who are in nursery. Now in nursery they are going for top graduation. Oli miyaka na mu etan. You're a mother. When you enter 50 years old, a mother of a top year graduate, a top class graduate, one hour is a miyaka kumineetano. This is where you need to nurture your daughter and son. Okumuga idinga, asoguloku vamo mwala ategerekeka. How are you going to do that when you are 60 year old? Is that too hard to understand? Wallahi laazim, personally, ninegiri jenyumiru wamo mwano mwala, who is in 20s, 30s, and they are busy having their kids, son and daughter space age age difference area wo bo basisinkana eh oyinza no gama maybe this is the young brother or, 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 or sister to this girl or maybe to this lady kumbe ye mwana we ye mwana we kategereke ka ko kategereke ka mete biba nyumira bintu ebyo and you're putting on this hijab eh nga ka hijab kalunji wakalengedde da kalunji no kasula mwa omuwala wo wa miaka msambu ni mujja munyuma ate Allah wa sasa mu ina kamotoka eh eh ni kujja bagira are you feeling that now this world is busy training you eh ndi a muslima to to waste na nawe to go and have kids enjoy this life now eh no yingira biri mwetano jo asatu bakuogereza they even giving you proposals bakuwase mujje mufuna wa abana abana just because you have these singers of yours abakulimba limba njo bufumbo mwana wafe ufumbo buzibu zibu to papira nyo ne we yingira mwana asatu mutano you're not even having a kid you're not doing us justice mutungwe so the islamic position is please this is the title you're supposed to feel proud with a mother and allah knew that this is a pride of any lady for any lady to feel proud atendo musajja for a guy to feel proud it might be more of properties but for a lady it's not properties we don't want to know how many plots you're having we don't want to know how many buildings you're having 
I don't have to tell you that your cars are not of our own benefit. We want to ask you, are you barren? You're like, no, I'm not. How many kids are you having? That's a pride, a, like a pride of any lady. When you, you're now 10 siblings, you have 10 siblings. That means your father and mother, Bazukuru, they are grandparents. When you're having a get together, you want to convince me to your mother as they are seated down, watching you, watching two generations, Imwe, Nabana, Baba Vudem. You want to convince me that they are not happy. And a lady who is busy focusing on their career, Ngatafa Ayuna Kuzala, they are more happier than this mother. This mother? Wallah alawdhim, it's, it will never happen. And if you want to find the sweetness out of that, try to interview any lady who is having her kids. Ngayabazala Buchari, and they are now Obama Adana Oksoma, these are ladies who are seated down. Ngataso wula kuhula milio neemu kwe kula mu shopping. Oya gala mugi la gira nyano umuchara. Ali mkuda genche ila negula. Kasana weka mocha. Bualwa na gila mbizimbe. Nobu wana bubi yoli mu top class. Yaluwa uo kwe zalila. Nga fave kulida ba mama ba febatu zalanga bachi ali. They are busy having some money. Wabanga inacha ya gala. She will never fall and ask guys. Abala laba sajia. Achimanya inayoba walabe. Abe kulida bakola. Achimanya inayoba lenzibe. Abe abakola. Bwabala abala mubu hati. Kale baba angaba kodo. Buliomu wa muwae mituwala abili. Kubano musambu. The center mekezo. Are you getting my point? Because the, we have back into our mind and we're like. If you're a mother and you're nurturing your kids. Ziburunji, you won't bring up a kid. Who will get a reason. Who will demand a reason. To provide to you as a mother. Isn't it? But we are being in this world now where ladies are not even being convinced that the fact that they have a position of being a mother, what even confuses me more is now trying to attach financial stability to this role of a mother. Just because a lady has no income, she doesn't deserve to be with their kids. Who told you? It has nothing to do with money. Are you sure your grandparents, your grandmother, your mother is that well off for you to be here? Is it yes? Is she having a plaza in town for you to be here? Is she having a plaza in town for you to be here? And this is the respect of a mother. And that's why these authentic, profound traditions of the prophets even their hadith, they are like, we really have to respect this lady. Because she deserves that. And that's why a mother deserves to be loved thrice as compared to a father. Come on, a mother does a lot to bring up a kid. When my kid is busy crying, how are you? Nemo jira mo naaseka naaseka. Baby, echi anga na tani koko kubo mlanga. Mama wanga ingira o. Zivya bi insuseko. Is that too hard to understand that now this mother, this mother has a special place. Kumwa ano ono. I think you're getting the point now. And now you're busy being convinced. Watani kanda no kuba time mutebo. You are a mother. Tona na kufumbiro no kari. Ne wachi susada. You're going to have the job. Eh, you will definitely have a maid. You're going to definitely have a maid. We don't need a maid. Please, be breastfeed this kid of ours. At least two years, breastfeeding is good. And now you mother, you want this kid. You're not breastfeeding them. Umano umala na yesa wabili Mulunaku Atenga yeko ye dechiro Buovakola Uyiriba Mama 
overcola you coming back echiro sawa nya echana chebase ate ku macha kama wa kwagala ku mulimu sawa emu chiba chizu kabuzu ku switch ti chikulabo ofuluma kati mbu sande yoka jiofuna in a full month enaku nya zo siba ne mutabaniwo and you call that being a good mother and when islam is like please it's okay go and work but please make it clear that your first permanent job is to be a mother if your temporary job here on earth is going to intervene within your responsibility as a mother please echo chokka watch yo gujjawo no no nyo mulimo gendo kulekere emirembe i normally advise my sisters and i'm like please the fact that your first permanent job is to be a mother don't prioritize being employed prioritize employing people obirenga gwe bossi otanikoka business ko nga you earn while you seated at home you bringing up your kids nga bana balunji nyo owakamelo jakate mamukano eh Katimba ntandikira wajja sin kesa batali wotandikira wankomyewa ngabalunji wojjo tandikira ngabalunji eh because eh sebo nawe tewe nera bidde eh tubaddewa eh aha yeah yeah when you hear as you're studying eh nsaba allah any girl who is studying building up a career my prayer is bambi ageze konyo to start up her own job at least we bata gena muku bila simu kusawa 12 avewo ewaka kumacha ngata agenda koma uchiro that is for us men to yibene dunia no way to do but not as a mother you already have a job your pa, your first permanent job full time job is as a mother and i normally advise my fellow youths eh and i'm like allah bwa kuwango busobozi nawe kigambe nga muganda eh gwapaka tebayi wa basajja abali wa nine nine kibagambi eh tell it to your brother allah bwa muwo busobozi nga yingiza sente kyandi sembe yo kulaba kwe kubanga at least monthly abako na aka sente kawa mchala we for two reasons reason number one, society rewards and just because a lady is home ngalira abana be mbushize failure bakube surprise nga failure ona aliye waka omwezi akwate mitwala asatu nga atete jili ko kukera te jili ko nagula mmere waka jije how sweet is that you want to convince me that just because you have a bachelor's degree eh ngo oli mugezi eh echo chokka china kutwe ka mu position eyiriba no If it needs to add on a master's degree obere mu office ngagwa we bilagiro ngagwe gwe balinda ngagwa yingira mu office sawe satu it is okay that's where you deserve as a mother because you have a full time job eyo kubera mama but now we are in the world where a lady is be, a mother is being slapped abana benga beba mwe kubira and now this mother is busy reciting hadith and the ayahs Mase kambulira ku mwana wange, mulira ku mwana wange, mwana wange asoseko, e mother. Mwana nga akusokako. Akusokaka ati yango mukuziza. It's because you're not giving them time. You're not giving them time. Omwana akula awezeze miyake ibiri. Naye nga sewo buli mwezi. Oina mwo na kuluolwa lumu. And when we, we make you sit down and you're like, but nage, why are you being injustice to your kid? Ngotani ko kulete songa zo. Eh? Nawe ensinga bo jiraba tuinoku tuinokola tuinokola muinokola 40 years from now when your son is going to be 30 or maybe 20 years or maybe 25 years omugamenti mwana wange jangonda beko mufune mwo butakanya akukube ko muchala eh gwenno goli mama akuletera akana akawala kakuvume Oyo gine ko nga mama ndio like my son your wife is abusing me omutabani omulabi wa filimu akugambe please mother know your limits this is my sweetheart i'm building a world with her 
you are my mother you are grown up kati mwokaba omwana akususeko your 40 years you were a failure mama gwe because you never invested in time okulabirira omwana ono of course i'm trying to tell this to young blood you're the new mothers of tomorrow wobe da mother at least your son and daughter is still young also from me imparting them that give them time that's the best investment join zokola chi join zokola and that's how islam positions a lady eh mumbera ngeyo and so islam calls every female and they are like you have this title please don't disrespect it don't disrespect it tumtane kana kujajinga abantu nga baina abana babwe baleke bakujajinge gwe wekulize bwana bwo wekulize bwana bwo emya kawe jiitawo twagala tulabe ku kwaba bakujajinga baina yo bameka we bagendo tani ko kusabiriza ku bana bana ma mpa ku mwana wawe umuleke wange taina yo mwana inza kuumulira asaba amanne pa ku mwana wawe umuleke wange yagano okuzala maybe they went into family planning being convinced that they need money to nacha a kid ebanga ne ligende banga ne ligenda saballa belenga atuwa entegereyo and that's the first title for a lady as a mother mm. prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam this is this is some of the traditions that come to me and i continue respecting a mother please do respect any mother and i salute you if you want or maybe if you to become one one day prophet muhammad a narration from abu huraira prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam was like i'm the first human being that is going to be to, to enter jannah in other words the doors of paradise are going to first get opened for me as a human being and then prophet was like fa idan almar'a tubadiruni like this comes a lady that is busy competing with me it's like she wants to get in jannah before me and then prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam was like asking the lady man anti who are you the lady will be like fataqul ana imra'a qa'adtu ala aytami li the lady will be like i'm a lady that settled down for one reason of nurturing and bringing up my kids that's a mother how many of ladies do we have that do that today you're busy comparing your kid and daughter i normally term it disrespecting your kid no mu comparing with some other temporary reason again do kubera wa kasera na kasera and you compare the two together and this lady this is how islam is respecting prophet is like this lady wants to enter paradise in other words Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala this is how eager Allah is to reward such a lady who is settled down prioritizing her kids over any other factor and today we are having a lady who is prioritizing a guy maybe this guy is not a father to her kid and they are prioritizing them busy putting their own blood kids behind closed doors ngabali to songa songa msimanya wanategera ndi no mwana takena kuntwala akuleke what's the problem with that if he's not ready to take you with your kid it's okay akuleke maybe someone will take you with your kid why are you treating this young blood now and keno close and mama wange tanjagala just because of someone gola byo bukulu ngasano kutala kenkera so islam is like no 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 a lady as soon as you give birth of course i know there are very many factors ngai mugeno zeta mbibuzo kila mrochitia okuba no msajja ngatala bila mwana we kila mrochitia okuba no msajja rangira bati manya basajja basi wala basajja mbwa tibala bila bana babwe it's okay it's okay omsajja no wabira yonga mbwa because they are not taking care of their kids 
it's not reason enough for you as a mother okumwega tako mubere mbwa mmeka bili ngatimwaka temula bila mwana wa mmwe am i making sense here omusaje wabanga aganyo kulabirira omwana we he's not in play come on be fair to your kid train them that at least you're there with them but you're busy telling your kid that your father your father is like this your father is like this omteka munno buchayi your father is like this mwana wangi kitegerere yo nandi kukuziza ngo libulunji ne na awo kitaba ala bechichi please respect that as a mother wallahi this world is doing is being unjust unfair kufefenna ne allah jali and allah is going to reward you in the right currency bola baba sajja abakuru abazeyi kukubo old men and females ngambo omugera agiranya mu if you trying to profile them they are in their late 60s what are they still doing outside in the torment of the world enkuba ngene yika egwere kujajja ngoyo ngaina abana ngaina na abazukuru but they are going to be forced to be there you are going to be forced to be there you are going to enter your 60s ngo cha ino kudaga okunonya fees obo mwana wo top class graduate nengo limu 60s atenga 60s awo bo genda kwefira 60s 70s awo echina nyo 80s nga wefira ngo mwana wo muleka mu meka awonno ngo wanga de omwana wo ngo muleka otyo nga alya mu miyaka 15 nga bakajja kone byo bugaga teka ina chikamanyi ngo lubaka twala mu fanage center nga kadagire yo akana bakabonya abonyiza nga bo lyao kage na mu family nga bakatwalanga a was step mother for example ne bakuboyo ne bakuboyo oluwo kubase bo liwa nokupiruzizo emyaka je yaga kupiruzi uwandi yewe chana chawo no kirabirira no weze emyaka ana bakiri emyaka 10 awo no ogenderera eh ogendo kona mu atano ngakiri mu abiri era uwabera wabi umwana wa abavuddemu obo kya ali awo ngola bakawala ko bakawasizza uri mu atano nao oyaka kunga amanti omuzadde who is busy with nursing their daughter getting married officially ngali mu atano mbusebo kato yo failure eh ngatali failure yo nali mu atano ngo mwana wali mu 50 mu top class graduate graduating a top class Omwana we first born ku myaka ya 5 oba ku myaka ya 4 mu 5 really ne dabambi ne dabambi ne wabanga yevuga ne wabanga ine bizimbe please don't intermix things ebitagatiwa money is something else and being a mother is something else sente zikera ku macha government ne kwechangira ka omusolo ne zigwa oba ne bakubba na ye chana cho kibanga o ochirabirira bo chifako na basadde abamu nanange obalwachi obangende bugeze ku point enda kubanga you give birth to a kid you're too lazy to do some simple research butia buinzo kuzo mwana wo ave munga ali healthy and you a mother the only advice you having there is advice za abanno abata naba na kuzala mbutwa uli account yo mwana is handled like this twa uli account yo mwana bwa yasimula oba bwa kasikonda bwa mukwata bwo munywegera wano kasikonda na agenda mukasikonda bwa mukwata bwa bafuna mubiri that's the advice you having you're not even as clever as a mother to look for a, a profession someone who, with baba itapata baba bana pediatricians or something eh Omubuzent I want to bring up my kid ngalya bulunja akola bulunji mpa basics and you're too lazy to do that oli mama and you're going to be claim you deserve to be loved thrice ku mwana oyo a mother who is living omwana omuto achayonka just because you can pump milk out of your breasts no gateka mu fridge ine kulu wo mtemperature we gumyolo kulu wo mtemperature no galawo mukate baje yaga amata bagawo mwana anune eh anune anune katimbo olwegulo okomone stress wo wo mulimu 
Ngoburi yao tewali dena burunji. Toi nakati mata. Omana akave. Eroje ya matagomu friji. Omwe. Okumaremi ya keji. Ngaje mwana u. Tuka na kuebuja. Luachaba haba naba walu urumu bati doku isa mune isa. Oba naba vubuka. E na isa nga mbutufu. It doesn't make sense. Chila bika beba haba naba yonka kubuntu obu. E miyake bili omana nga yonka bukati. Because the fact that you're breastfeeding this kid, it, it goes beyond making them satisfied. Omana as early as four months, five months, about Andy Sokubanga Tegeda, the scent of a mother. Nani waba akaba, naranza no kuri kognaizinga. This is the face of my mother. Wabata kuri kognaizinga, ngari mutulo, akaba, omuyonsa aliyao, takula bie, na ya smelins, ya smelins, it, oh, oh, kanoka woke ika mama, na yonka at peace. Gwari kuchiboto omuwa. Okumale mi akeja? Ebili. And now after 10 years, you want the same kid. Akuwe respecti. Mbwa kwa gale minunde meka? E sato. So prophet was logically trying to treat and train mothers. Mama nyenti, please, for in order for you to deserve being loved thrice. Ngumana uya kwa gala, you have to make sure you're being a right mother to them. But if we're having mothers who are busy throwing their newly born babies mukasasiro on places of worship ni baba lekao na komao after 20 years old ngata claiming anti mama wo ogenda kweta gadisi nyingi nyo no mwana no kubanga bade mukutu ba nyingi nyo ngate mugumikiriza nyo okudda mu welcoming anga mama we ne ubo ine nsonga anti mwana wange na isi ina mere jinalinkuwa that's not a reason he will understand aja kubuza twandi suzenya na inga ndi nawe are you getting the point? Yes. Please, whoever is going to watch this, please get a lesson. Maybe this is the reason. And if you hear, still young blood, before you become a mother, prioritize your kids. As soon as they grow up, that's the only treasure. Because you will need them more. As you grow old. Ni wabanga bawa kwe changi dekonga wa siza wa chala wa balala. Habana wabu wajia kubeda anga u. Ngokaba wabu wanyonyola. Ti muntege ere nga u. Muntege ere nga u. Bari yao. Hukenda kabila ni mchala gwe. Ngumana wa miyake satu. Ni miyaka jana muetano. Uinu maka wa miyake eja. E satu. Umuka habita habita gira. Haiza luga mama kaba kaba nyo. Ni yu wabamu kuru. Ainza no kuku wataka wanti mama, please, be patient. Olunga mwana ina kudini. Gumikiriza. Tubele uo. Are you getting my point? Saba Allah berenga. Aba sobe isa mbele pa mama abadunchi. Because that's what Islam trains any ladies. Secondly, Karrama al-Islam al-marata zawjan. Islam respected a lady as a wife. And please, I don't want you to start bringing your factors. They treat us bad. Blah, blah, blah. We are this and this. We are this and this. Ah, your husband, Wabanga, Kuisa, Bubi. Allah, ya Kugereda. Wabanga kuhisa bulu unji, nabo jebali, wababa bebele yu mkwosu dozi, jebali wababa bebele yu mkwosu unji. Ideally, Islam respected a lady as a wife. And when Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam was trying to guide the companions during the times nga society did too immoral, nga basadja, benzi, these men gabadi too immoral bakula practices they are, they are they are worshiping idols you know what prophet considered prophet even when he was trying to give them advice he was like please train and treat well your ladies gamazeno kubaga manti musali bulunji mukolewe muti but he knew that the respect that deserves a female you really have to respect them as wives too 
what teaching in Islam are you going to find? Nga a wife is disrespected. Just mention one. Never te chiriyo. To the extent that even when your wife, maybe a wife is barren, that alone is not a reason for a husband to take them back at home. For the fact that she deserves that respect, what are you pinning them for? You better marry the second wife who isn't barren, but you leave the first barren wife with respect. It's only in Islam. And other traditions are like, Obero tanga tozala. Bamula mubo be bokutani kako. Tozala. Mutu dizeye wa wa tukoze nyole osi. Tuletu romana akolachi. Azala. It's only in Islam that respects a lady even with that. And now you claim that Islam is not respecting ladies. You are respected as a wife. Very many authentic narrations. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam in a hadith narrated to us by Jabir. Prophet was like, Ittaqullaha fin nisa. Men, he was trying to advise men. Please, every man, fear Allah, be Allah conscious when it gets to dealing with your wives. And it's like Prophet was trying to train every man to treat their wives with respect. And not only that, Prophet was like, Fa innakum akhadtumuhunna bi amanatilla. You got these wives, these ladies as your wives, and Allah was a witness. You included Allah as you were trying to make them official as your wives. So only that is a reason to know that you really have to respect them. Allahu Akbar. How I wish every man respected that advice. And of course they are there. They respect their wives. I think at times, Is it possible or not? It is. Some husbands are good and they are respecting their wives. Some of the ways that show that the husband respects you when they are real to you. Yeah. And then those are the husbands you don't want. And the only way a husband can be nice, treat a lady with respect, is to be real to them. And Prophet was busy guiding the guys. Why? He knew that a lady Islamically is also respected as a wife. Actually, Prophet was like, even when, the guidance of Islam, even when a lady has performed any misconduct, Ngachini is almost their husband, there is a way you're supposed to treat them. Guess what? The first way. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the Quran was like, Fa'idhu hunna. Discuss with them. Talk to them. When a lady is being stubborn, a yomba yomba nyu, a complaining a complaining a nyu, Islam is like, no, 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 you don't complain back. Sit them down. Talk to them. You're like, oh, my wife. It's this and this and this. How are we going to overcome that? This is a, a, a husband respecting a wife. And if it doesn't work, the second step is there. Detest them. Don't have intimacy with them. Don't sleep with them. And back into the mind of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, maybe logically Allah is like training men that there are different ways of trying to put these fragile creatures in place. After sweet talking them and it's not working, try to act. Try to act. How? By acting, trying to detest them. Once in a while, if a lady is clever, she will get to know that 
if the talking never worked and now he has started acting i really have to work upon myself and if it doesn't work prophet was like okay consider what beating much of longer beating and you know do you know the kind of beating that is that we mean islamically it's not the beating you know that is acted in the films no when scholars were trying to to analyze and explain to us the beating that allah subhanahu wa ta'ala was trying to mean it's the kind of punishing that isn't impactful and it doesn't cause any permanent pain not even a temporary one to leave a mark on you mufiri kagula benga yo mtufu nkuba ntufu eh mbosebo ngwataka tambala ngakana eh mbose my wife why you took kwa rosamu bunga nkuba wendi mbo ti use eh onachi usagwe Actually, you might even think that oh this is he's being romantic but back into logically we, we translate this and we are like for a lady who is clever and she is pious all she needs ye musajja okumulaga any sign eraganti simo simo echo chokane chiringa bell into her mind and she's like i really have to work upon myself awona ngalla chimanyi ntibawa kusinga amany but amuganyo kukubech code respect as a wife and if it's not working out i normally bring an example msaja inzo kwata glass ayo gedde now the first time to chusiza omwezi good akusengu sasengu semwao now oli muko wa musengu kadda tebikoze agizeza ko gwo kusatu mbwa kubonereze muko the only way you are going to kubonereza muko i normally advise ma, 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 youths and husbands nemba gama anti wobango okakasa the lady gwe wawasa munadini nga si si wa kuyiriba hmm? all you need is a glass of water to make a point and we won't have any body ojaji ko na bukonye ku meza ngato chikola ko myaka etano jimumaze and you like over the chigwe and it will ring a bell ku mchala ategera ina magese because a jagamant oh e myaka etano simusomanga muchino tatu ka ku level e yagala ku asa glass ne chimukolera echo bwe chigana Islam is like okay involved involve the third parties now. Muito muto kuba ku family yo muchala ni kusaidi yo musaja mbitule mu echo we chigana even with respect mwao kana mbitiwa. Wala tansa ul fadla bainakum. That's the Quranic verse. Even when you've divorced the Islamic stand is come on she was your wife you don't abuse them as the aftermath. No. You treat them with respect. Nyumba nga ba mwau kanye. Era ba nange mwe. Je muna akomo kuva mu position za mwe nga bachala. Je mugendo koma. Okwe jako right season mwe. Cuz islamically when a guy is divorcing you, the discipline islamically is abako ne chakuwa for you to start a living. Takule kabule si bwati. Wallahi it's islamic a Quranic verse ndio musajja sebo wabaya ukana nawe after 6 years katibiganya mukanyiza for sure we have two kids but it's not working out the only option is divorce nga mwemuli obulunji islam is like okay you husband she is a mother to some of your kids kwata yoka kakadobo kadobo bidi omwene project ya business and i'm like it's islamic just to respect a wife actually someone who has been your wife but how many men are considering that in actually mubanja na mubanji 
Onde kotia, kato na kompadeyo, wachi limpa ye chapa, oba njoro, weruwa anako. Because you know, the background you're having, taina, taina wana wasi nziri na kuwa yoka proti. Oina kaba jabu wani mukoti, ni muba, gana oba antoni, zine bajida, bablo, balo ya, oruana. Oina kwe osiko zawa, o zawuo. And islamically we are like, neda. Omusajyo na inoku respecting, even when you're not here, you're done being their wives. Aku respecting her, because at least you had some history together. Ningo, of course, tachisu siza. Is that bad? Om siram, okumanyanta, at least Islam is favoring me, respecting me as a wife. And that's why, batu kwa notu jirege ila, abala basiramu, nga bafumbiru wa mangu. It is okay, they want to enjoy some of these benefits. This respect as a wife. Kubanga, ideally, tumanyinti mchala msiramu, Afudeyo nyoku laba anga guwagi ndo funa musina mumu na ina kumagezi. Agina mutu iti ingabuchi. Buru unji. You don't want to get married to a husband. Who is not going to respect you as a wife. You have to consider that. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us that guidance. Allahumma amin. Wude wuchi aliyo nawe saazi wezi msamu. Okay. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. In the last tradition, before I switch to the third factor, Prophet was like, When you're trying to deal with ladies, wives, consider always guiding them with, with kindness, with goodness. Yeah. But even with your being big headed, the husband is not guided islamically. Okuk bengoro. No. <laughs> he's not guided like that. Wabla he's guided. That, oh, she's big headed. Don't, don't beat her. Don't treat her violently. Speak with her with goodness. Hmm? Try different approaches. Bali kumasaja nyo Treat with her with guidance. Eh? Goodness. Eh? Try different approaches. Eh? Mutu wale kwa auto mwe nsonga, yubo uli ya wajite gede. Tutuliku msaji ono go treat in zebubi. Why? He has a responsibility of treating you and respecting you as a wife. It's only in this religion. And of course I know, mwge na kunga mati, basaji ya bameka abaliyo, nganangi nkubuza, wakafumbi wa bameka. Muka tegede, muma nyotu zikiza, bulu tugeza wa kuleta ideal situation ni, wapisila mbuga wa tukule wetuti, nga wani kwa mkono, wallahi seka, Husseini, abasajja wa mekaba loza, wallahi tabali yomu nsimuno, nga nangi nkudi zorwa, wakafumbira wa meka, tona na kufumbira yonu ogwa, no mu, na yese wakanya, niti abasajja wa kolachi, babi weba tiyo, leka na watobo oyo chisusiza, aksilu buta nisena ukutule itanati yemu, umu wano ono, Tana wakufumbiro. Na yese bo, ilimu ya basaja ya jite gira nyo wati. Ila kata obo, oba we wandi seko ngo gamanti mba manyi. Even when I'm not married, but at least I have the background of something like five men. Mba dena bo, umuna mana na yemi yake vili, umanema na yemi yake satu, kati mba te gira. Bia mitu yo ino kusirika. Allah wana api kukumira. Allah wana kusasira na oba dena bo, ni bata kwa sanguza. Obe nene ka history kako. Nga teja kamanyi. Ntu oise muntalo za basajja ba meka. Meka di. You're even making it no more. Ne wakuchaza ku TV. Edanze. Oba. Ateze nkakasa. My understanding. The fact that injirina. Even someone else they are jirina. Kupa Allah tatote ya tona muntunga aliogwa. Even ne muntegera. So this lady is on TV station. Simu fumbo. Kati you're being inspired by them. Kubanga liku TV. Ategwe toba wanko ku TV. Kati now you're like inspired by them. Na tula buru njibu hati nga yena anjiride. 25 kari 28 years old. Young girl. Na vamo obu gamonti. I don't know why but some men. Ahoko ka. Some men. Turn out to being this and this. But for me personally, I, I, I opt for this and this. But now young Muslim, and I know very much, even now I am being inspired by this man. Oh, you are some men. 28, you are 
abesinze kuchi wachi ya tugament ya fumbirwa ko ne bigana i know icho tugamba ne ita fumbirwa ngako it becomes worse ngagwo mufumbo kati gumu wado obudde no ulirizo mutono atamanya na kumanya bafumbirwa abata te bamwanga na kumahare meaning no one has ever respected her as a wife stories hizo na zaina za basing ra kokuwa advice they are respecting her as a side chick bamukubira bokubizi simu they come to come here for the weekend najja ne bayiriba na yiku weekend yonna nadda yiku mande now just because ayiriba na yiku weekend wano she's getting this confidence oba ba motivation speaker yo wana baba aba amanyago najja ne ku tv natalo woza mu konti someone in the audience is watching and we are going to profile them we are like na himu chala gwe you in your 30s you don't have any marriage history no one has ever respected you as a wife all they are respecting you as a side chick bia ukana bantu mwe a wife is a wife and a side chick is a side chick katigwe side chick you want to talk on behalf of wives muba gobanga mubategeranga okubanga ne simu no mutegeza anti muchala gwe thank you for the program but you're misleading many people out there ina na at least to be that one eh they are misleading you like that omuntu aino kuwa kwa device aino kubanga era asana mukurukuru obanga mufumbo atenga ne kumageza aina mubitege de bintu ebi not everyone advises everyone ku bintu ebyo ah ah most especially kumu abachala cuz your emotional charge mu emotional zita muzi kumpi kumpi yao bao bwa kuvuma muwano uyirango yagira omuntu goyogera na ya mangu mangu awo bwogwira ku program ku tv yao ne basoka bakubwa ate mana gwe ne bogera kantu nga bao yakako laloga mamutufu bali ku kitufu bale bale ne bao ne bao yiriba nawe forgetting that you are respected as a wife togenda sula bweru ngwe kube kuba and bo bode gera na bako bire bweru ngomusadda omusajja amwe chaangiddeko are you getting the difference So islamically we respect wives and that's the discipline of islam eto toli kisanga walala wonna wives are respected mu busilamu saballa belenga atwa that understanding and please remember that you get married to someone who is ready to respect you and that's why even the guidance that is there islamically ku bantu abafumbidwa ababili a man is not allowed to disclose to talk about you with anyone not even his other wives to the extent they are not allowed to talk about you umaso gabo buliyomu abere munsi isn't that respect and it is haram you're the first wife and the second wife lokwa yo yo wodi ona basajja abachisusa lokwa katagena wasa second wife na tani kokuba okogera obubi ko ko first wife you know i never i never mm, i never loved my first ba muntu ameza kale utameze ya sayagala na ye gwata yagala myaka etano bali bonna i never loved we, i never loved them kati no katayogera no nawe eh mba akogereza oli namba mmeka chimanyenga ndiyo che nyini ne waba mulunja atya akulagidde want the fact that he is not respecting e yakusoka yo what makes you think that he is going to respect you gwaze eto chimala bomazi ngo mugama ntwe bali nyoko yoyogerako na yesi sobodde ngagenda as simple as that ne yo mutu kwakutukira kama na namchala wanga asoka na chikomi yao tumaze na yebanga kweliti na na bana banga webati ekyo chikumalo kuba mu tegedent kati musajja wa ofnines wa ina akola chi najira mu line yentufu na yinja gala kuwa sanga mu chala wange namba mmeka namba 2 bogeza kono kulima na hata kati olinja gala mulaba gala mukola atya ngaga mati nedda bambi kakanyako ojja mulaba mukasera akachi ngo manya to musajja ono yategera nti obusira mbu respectinga a wife material na yingo manya atkatogude mikono emichi emitofu 
ngo kiriza nga bakwetu walira muyiri bilale esimanye buba bibija luva nyuma na yenga okozotya ogenze hmm hmm tumale kusala oba tutumale tutujire eh ngasira oba azina oba tuchekolele ko wanofe tukume wano tutwesalire eh iye ah imam seka badruddin taliwo Eh katulini tumanyo mwazi nyaizo kujja. Mm? Let's get to the third title. Karama al-Islam al-mar'ata bintan. Islam respected a lady <laughs> as a daughter, as a girl. Tanafuka waifu. Mm? Tanafuka mama. But at least you're a girl. Islam respected you too. Era munai ngoga mantoi na wogwa. If you're not a mother, if you're not a wife yet, at least you're a girl. Get to know that Islam respected you as a girl. And I normally make it a point that even Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala in the Holy Quran was like أو بلا مستوى رجيم ولا يسذكر كالأنثى. A baby boy is not the same as a female. The way you nurture a female, a girl child, is totally different as compared to the way you bring up a boy child. If you bring up a boy child ngo mkuza ngo mwana omwala biba na vuka bitula babe mola mola omwana akuze mvubuka na yaye mola mola bwayogera abantu na yaye mola atambulanga bavubuka choka tuli kumulembo gwe bisiyaga kala tubuza abuza if you bring up a girl child nga girl child deno mkuzi zanga mvubuka otukoze bubi nyo lesbians muweri uno mwana omwala mubyekaliza na muntu yo etomu boy mfinyo no amanya kati mbu tomu boy Goya galabi free quarter ngoli wa mwe goya galo kutambula ngo msajja no kuogera kati you making sure you you you're competing boko paka msajja bogera batya nayo boyogera nga msajja you're not doing justice to our society echo msila mbwachire yingadda a girl child is brought up as a girl child a boy child is brought up as a boy child period and you're going to only find that in islam Balageke ebilaganti omwana ono mwala is respected. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Aisha narrates to us in an authentic tradition. She was like dakhalat alayya imra'a. Our mother Aisha radhiyallahu anha was like one day a lady came to me Ma'aha ibnatani she was with two girls daughters and actually she was trying to request for something to eat Aisha was like I made it a point to give her tamratan one date intende nganene intende and you know what this mother did the mother to the two daughters na yawlam the date hmm? babi tabatia hmm? bisected kazungu kama katufu wako <laughs> she bisected the date eh? into two eh? half and half now the two daughters to eat without her eating the mom ninga aisha yakoze echi ya chimuwadde aisha is now narrating to us hmm? fashaqatha bainahuma walam ta'kul minha shay'an the mother herself Never ate anything but at least she made it a point let my young daughters take this debt fadakhala alayya rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam aisha was like when prophet came back to me of course i had to narrate everything that this this lady came and this is what i did and this lady made it a point to bisect a debt now abana be without her eating you know what the prophet said manibtulia 
min al-banat bi shay'in prophet was like whoever is tested by their girls in any way any parent that is tested by their girls in any way positively and negatively fa ahsana suhbatuhunna but then even when they are tested with these daughters these parents are busy considering perfecting the way they are treating them treating who the daughters but we get ako cut for example tulikumuzadde ngo ayiriba nawe bwa kugama mwala wange don't don't move at night when you gamba tata lectures igwanya ezechiro ate jamu munji paka tano ewako yingira wo mukaga tata na kugamba lero nencha neruli oruko ba msajja yekadide tacha ina manyi gakuba kuba kutya osobolo muisamu obo kuvao ne wechanga kati mbonyize nyo ndure wechanga nokya no fumbi twanga tako zechi na gambo why mwala wange kamukolechi kamuleke bulesi prophet is like fa ahsana suhbatu hunna and whoever is being tested by their own daughters na considering okubanga alemerako okubanga abayisa bulunji even when they are tested you know what the prophet said prophet was like hadisi ngeya gala kumbula kuwanate aha prophet was like kunna lahu sitran min an-nar these daughters are going to act as a barrier for them to prevent them from hellfire and that's how islam respected daughters a daughter well raised echochoka it might be a reason for your parents to be prevented from hellfire it's only on a daughter and that's why prophet muhammad in another tradition he was like man ala jariyatain whoever is nurturing up two girls in some narrations one girl or maybe more than one girl to raise them up a girl who is now a teenager she's still a virgin she is 20 years old nga simu yenzi 25 years old she is still morally upright that alone it's a reason prophet was like i myself i'm going to be with those parents fa ashara bi aswabi'i prophet was like kaha time i'm going to be with those parents like this anyone any parent who is nurturing a girl child nava mo mulama i'm to be with them in jannah that's only on a girl child and you know what that means you need a lot to nurture and bring up a girl child because with a boy child just yet aka kwesi lwaza mu bwa te dunia mbe amanyenti wabata ina sente taina chali amagezi gakomewo ayiribene nseno avemo omulamwa nge dunia mukozeje na yego just chi musajja ina sente nga taina mpisa ku miyaka 15 na kubuza and your perplex confused that oh oh edense oji maze no genda na kuzala mu abana babiri nenge mpisa zo nensi ufuziva muiye ngatata kujewa mu mukutongole no daye wa mu na abana babiri ngabakuze instead of doing justice to your parents all you're doing kumu abana oloku bagwe to ina wabate kama chibuga bano no ba wa abana bo mwako ogumu abachai abacheta ago kuyiriba mama wo we myaka enkaga ne tata wo myaka ensanvu bakadde beta ago muntu abayamba but they won't send your one year kid ne bayiriba na ye nakabe chiro they have to rest ne oloku ba muzukuru wa bakaba and they love them ne bazukuka lwachi te bafe mango <laughs> why are you getting the point lwachi te bafe mango eje bise ebi bisera bya kuwumula bya kweba kama mangu sawa bili nga mama zisha kuzuku not lote baba na cho rusi bazu kama mangu awo sawa 10 yao baba bazu kusa 10 nemo baba ine byo kola just kuwumula awo kugenda mu nimiro bafune byo kulya abatume tume ku bantu abakuze kuzemu oba kubyo mugu omwana omwako ogu 
or walk over sebo oli wano you're not even respecting the fact that you're respected as a girl child echo chokka every muslim bwa manya anti islam respects her as a girl child that alone rings a bell within your mind no manya i have to do justice to my parents echo chokka please be the reason for them to enter jannah because it's hard to raise a girl child it's really hard of course how i wish a mother of a girl is here you know what i'm talking about do you know what it means for a girl child who is now 10 years old over 15 or okwa chance so kujimuka jimuka we chiti chana chiwala chiyali chito and gents abasaje batani so mugereza as young as 15 years old and with a boy child is different 15 years old chizibu nyo ideally bayizo kutamkwana ngali 15 years old acha ali nafala aina mala kujira bwati wala bere bere film 20 years old atan kokufuna amanyi ajemu akuongereza but with the girl it's the opposite bamutandika wa miaka mwenda lwakuba mujimu bulunji and you really think she's not going to be affected as young as that ngabata ni somuwe mula don't you think as a parent i know buvuna anyizibwa to make sure you're protected that's why they are like omwana wange tagenda wantunga ali yeka and today the world is like just because your parent is too smart protective okubanga ayagala okujja mu mulamwa no funa abantu awo ba motivational speakers ba feminists awo abakuwaga and you're like you have the right as a girl to move out there kusawa satu ezechiro ngoli weka you grown up you have a phone eh hey, you have a phone what will a phone do when you're being raped what will a phone do wobo wise mbasajja kusawa sate zechiro ngo banyiriri denaka wokwe we kuba ne bagamba kaba kugoberere bakufunze awatali talanga mutambula what is your phone going to do do you know how many ladies are raped as they are being robbed When a guy is being groped because ideally abasaje baba ina amanyi be baba. Bwa sanga anze okujja nga musiyaze abanja gazaje. Ekino nya kuba bikonda awo nanzi jake simu awo ne sente wallet nga agenda. Laba gwa ku gwe. Wenyiririra da sawa zili satu gwa ina iPhone bwo tambula no mpola tambula mu mbeja eh toyagana kufayo bwa ku jake simu bwa kukozesa ato mulabye uli wa lugambo ruo nga kwetira is that hard to understand is that hard to understand eh? am, am i making sense is that hard to understand that as a girl child ne wobo tambula it's okay tambula ne muganda wo tata wobo akugamba anti zuwerenga 12 muwala wange ngo oli wano understand him he is a guy he knows Bota gama ntata maze miyake ebili ntambula nkoesa taxi nkoesa boda emyake ebili ojimaze nene bebatta pamale emyake etano so ideally islam respects a girl child ntisebo nabaza de bachi tegera that's why there is a boys quarter outside the house there is no girls quarter ndi you girl you're supposed to sleep inside with your dad and your father you are precious you respected kati seba abavubuka omubi ne wabawa kujasokere kubbo bayiribe na ye wabale manga abasse namwe mba mwazo fuita police oru ngamwe muona ye ngamazo kwefira that's the respect of the girl child osula munda and now we are being trained that just because you are a girl human rights is for human rights see? you think the world is doing you justice munawe sebo olokubo ne myaka abiri eh olokubo ne myaka abiri mwe tano yagulo kokogera ku kusimu ngaba kuogereza no sabata tabu please father i want to go in the boys quarter no stroll utalwe wakao no gano kulye mmere eh no nyinyiza la abo baganyo kuwa boys quarter yawa yewelu now you also want to enter like you want you want to enter you get out as you want come on and i normally advise uh, my 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 students in makerere university the islamic dating and marriage series we have 
I normally advise guys and I'm like do you know what it means to marry a girl at 20 years <laughs> a girl who is 20 years ngabazadde be bamuvako tata we yakanya ne mama we this girl Allah yamutuletiranga kigezo katumwene boys quarter afumeza yagala ayingereza akola chi mbo bakwagala nyo sebo eh And I normally advise them and I'm like Nedda if you want someone to play with oyo mwangu nyo even when you put an appointment kusawa nyeze echiro aja kubera wo a komewo kusawa 10 nemu to yage na mukola chi but a lady who is well brought up okona ko bukonyi nti sawa nya na kwe unya no kwe unya ngalabe si jo limtajitegera sawa nyo njaga zaachi i have to be home at sawa 2 and for your information tata wange na muga abachi Boy ranga tani so mwalo kogera ku bintu ngwe ebi anono ku wakati pwe baba ku ogereza anga ngabya chiro kan kabere kafe ne obena kalo inaka background ya kavundu eh fera fera mu konto ina mu ensezo eh bona ye tata wangena mugamba ne baba tali yongo chimai tajja kubuza tata wangena mugamba chi mama wangena mugamba chi at least for them to know that you are answerable to someone no guy needs a wife material Ngone mubwala we as a daughter she was not respected as a daughter Everyone needs a wife material nga she was respected as a daughter nakula na making a good wife material bebo ba mama abalunji betu ino lwalero ba mama bo bo ino lwalero But the reason why many of girls are not respected as daughters that alone by default makes them bad wife materials and by default it's going to make them bad mothers by default cause ingana yewe yakula nava kubana be bwagendo kwate simu ajiweka wala ka kemya ke ebiri kachaka kubawa mazina ngakamba do to pare and it's going to make sense to this mother now kumba tukuliza ka wala ko no ne fu and i'm like umwana mutabani wange ngala bye kati ngakula nga asanga ako ngana yako ogereza kumbe mama we yali ensonga but if a girl is respected as a girl child na kulanga mwala mulunji that respect islam gave you obviously by default you're going to make a good wife material by default if you make a good wife material you're going to make a good mother and that's the guidance of islam i think i'm making sense eh? i think let's wind with this last factor after we pray and then we get to the question and answer session karam al islam al mar'ata ukhtan islam got to the level of respecting a lady as a sister too every title that a lady has islam guided and respected you in that respect and i want to just mention one tradition of jabir Jabir but Ibn Abdullah when he wanted to marry he married an old lady and when he marched to the prophet prophet asked Jabir that yes you married someone is she a virgin or yazirwana ko she's an old lady Jabir was like she's not a virgin she's an old lady prophet was like how i wish you considered marrying a virgin and he gave a reason when the lady is young it's very easy you play with her she plays with you eh ya love love la vida vista fe jabir made a principle or maybe a principled factor he was like ya rasul allah i intended to marry this old lady and he gave a reason that prophet certified him jabir was like ya rasul allah my mother and father are no more they passed away in a battle and they left with me as their big as a big brother i'm having my other young sisters so it's my role as a big brother to make sure i marry a lady who is not of the same age with my young sisters in order for them to respect her and for her to nurture them properly 
and when Jabir mentioned that akarrahu rasul prophet certified Jabir because that was a very vital factor for this big brother to consider and that tradition alone trains us that a lady is also respected as a sister and that's why every brother islamically encourages brothers to once in a while pay visits abruptly to you after you're done marriage you know why just to check how you're being treated that's islamic that's the role of a brother and that's why even you someone is asking a hand of marriage in case your dad is not around in case your grandfather is not around the third position is for your brother it's because you're respected as a sister are you sure as a sister you deserve that respect your brother is just too protective achimanyi kuba ye musajja amanya abasajja abayayi babera batya and now he's trying to bring an opinion to you as a sister young or old na kugama to my sister omuvubuko yo akwagadde na yenga embera sintufu oloku basebe weko lilo limwala atonu mutobo no mugaba totonda labansi kana kavubuka ka brother ko kali konsa cause by nature by nature a brother will always be concerned ku sister we that's by nature era bobango ina brother wo ganya kuvako you're not respected as a sister don't be a reason for that at least be a sister ngo chimanyi nti buganda wo asobola kuloboza ko do you even know that with the islamic law of inheritance a brother is given more as compared to what you receive as you're inheriting you know why what you're receiving is yours and what your brother is receiving has your portion to take care of you just in case tino bo fumbi dwa bao ne yekubye mizimu na kugoba it's the responsibility of your brother to take care of you akuwe nyumba wona asura how many brothers today that find sense in harboring their own sisters mumakaga abo ngoli mulamu okuja unga ati amu lutalo katate mulamu atani so lutalo ne ne muchala wange bla 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 you katembolo you're not respected as a sister check your being a sister so that's islam and that's our beautiful islam if every girl if every lady respects the fact that they are respected as sisters echo choka socially you're creating a very beautiful environment for you obango ina baganda bonga munana eh go security kato maze obuli burunji if you're a good sister ne obaya ne baganda bo munana gwa gwa ina sister yo kam ogwa bomu nenga ba kuvako you're not being respected as a sister and islam encourages them to respect you as a sister you see how islam respects ladies kat motivational speaker very with their beliefs feminism story eh omusajja alinga muchala omuchala alinga musajja mulwana gina position yolo eh oloku basebo what a man can do a woman can do better a woman can do a woman can do better yikatemba kataliwo eh no liranga mulyo oli musajja mumbera zo na just wakubwa oli muchala ne baganda bane bakuvako kubango okola ne mine bibatakola bakwebonya let them play their role because they have that entitlement of respecting you as a sister those all about them winding up you're respected as a young girl because you're a reason for your parents to enter paradise so the parents are guided to nurture you well basabulo kuefunira kujana you're also respected as a sister tinobo okuzibwa ngawali wa kuita sister they are also encouraged to respect you with all the islamic principles 
they are there tulikumbwe ndo bachala you also respected as a wife ndino obera omuchala mmaka you have that respect by no kuwechiti bwangani ngo omuchala for whatever story you're having mufumbo bomwe you have to be respected as a wife and lastly you have to be respected as a mother and to connect mu bintu ebyebina anyone who is respected as a sister by default they are going to be respected as daughters maybe anyone who is respected as a daughter by default they are going to be respected as sisters because they are morally upright and if you're respected as a sister that alone by default is going to let you be respected as a wife and as you're respected as a wife by default you're going to be respected as a mother trust me if you don't consider all that you won't even be respected as a female what i normally think of and i'm like pitying you eh nemba kwa tibwa kenna kunga bachala a lady is someone who is convinced tikatukuwemi twale etano fifteke kale kanchi susemu kuba benzo gama ndi zese kwate mtwale etano who is convinced tikapa muwemi twale kumi 100k or 200k with the reason ndi yeyambule mwao ayambale patra azine mu video nga kuna mye mwao kati video yeno bwe malo fuluma this girl aji downloading a sharing ekone mikwano je kubange mitwale bidi yajifuna ate they are doing him a favor ndi bamulaze nsi nga kuna ma and those are the people that are getting interviews given interviews mu public bakugambe chi as a muslima does that make sense in jahiliya before islam a lady was someone who was influenced by the power and the money of men today we are starting to see that just because a man out there is rich just because a man out there has power and authority it's not reason enough for them to disrespect a female as far as islam is concerned and that's why islam is there ne kati muli wano bamanyira mmwe oluoku bomu sajja ina send watu kawo dyao bamanyira mmwe oluoku basebo aina office ja tulamu watu kawo dyao kati no wali omuntu wa banga public figure eh Uruko sibo public figure uruko bakati celeb who told you that just because someone is a celeb eh i know ku influencing no gwa muna nyo no mulaba no mulaba eh no yanga mutufu ni uze yaka kugwa ko no sembero ro no no wana right for ni me here oli mchala msidamu you putting on a veil like about all you bagwe muwe but you but you having a respect by default wabanga public figure ya kusange woli Eh hey, ubango mutukirira to mutukirira mbanji wo mugama ta mutufu ndi fani wo yongera mu amanyi na kuyize ko kino ne kino wo barakallah fikum no muvira ngataka kuteko takukoze eki nene mu magwamu you disrespect yourself please ensite patwala nga speed we but you islam respected a lady era zo luenda obwala wala akuna makuna ma ajira bwati bwayogera agamba ganene mbantu boloku bayina data bwajira bwati tiktok siye yajja ne yambula mwao na ajira bwati nazi na kayimba olwe eh? ye mama moyo wencha and she wants to be respected as a sister she wants to be respected as a wife ngano musajja agenda kuwasa aizo kula video jo tadeyo you want to be respected as a mother kubanga internet tayera bila you're putting something on your status after 24 uh, 24 hours nga status igwe kolachi evako but people are downloading your status 
your your son and daughter you don't want your son and daughter 10 years from now to see whatever you're doing now is that too hard to understand it's not please ladies simu bubi eh ne ebintu mbiroze ngako this is the respect you can't know this respect into obsira mbwaji kwa in all your titles all titles no, you don't. Just walking. A Muslim lady. You don't walk like someone who is not morally upright Islamically. Wallahi. Even talking. You, you know why Islam discourages you to openly talk? Why do you always think that Islam is doing is being unjust with you? Logically, the reason behind. A man is easily sexually enticed as compared to a female. As I'm here addressing you ladies, Chizibu nyo, chinza no buta hape ni inga. Sesho ni negu wako. Nga you're not charged here and there. Nga tonda bie, smayati, labile waiti, labile waiti. Okujo mkayo ni nao, ozengo inebi zibu bie. But when a girl is here, nga fabasajja faba to dao, only men, nga guomwala guwa liwano. Mba nino kubi confusing ati, my confidence, I want this confidence, nga swano kogira maso gaba sajja. It's okay. But when you hear what every man that is watching you is saying, Chizibu nyo, 95% of them, Bajababa kubi demu da ufana. Because that's men. Okuja konga, toi nacha umugamba mo nkula yonga taina budemu. Na hengu ulimu wala uyamba demu runji buwoto, nyiri demu runji buwoti, uyogirana demu runji buwoti. No jamu audience inga yaba sajja buka. So Islam is like no. Whichever angle you get, no credit from each other, no, but disrespected. Gaba mukubi amu bufani yewe babozam. Ah ah, katuli meetinge njogera ye. Dine musola yenzo maluachi hutu bate mojiwa. Si mukuba manira. Dite musobo la kuogera. Musobo lo kuogera. And that's why your mothers, you train our kids to speak well. Na yewe waliwo just because you're respected. Ebo msa mli bugama antineda. Tuto jiko manira kabu yako. Omishara wa fomu siramu, ayogirenga, at least hapa manyamu batu wano gamati. Ok, wapa wakogira mu public, ebelenga ili mixed, atenga abatono, beba sajja, gabanji beba chi, beba chala. Ne wapira mba chala bane, hapa kube mbozi zao. I think you're getting the point. All those principles, to respect you as a lady. You want to tell me that a girl who is addressing 100 men, boka, omuwalu oyo, you're busy seeing the positivity in it. Nti alimu kufuna confidence, alimu kufuna babi itapatea vila, ya luzungu zungu binja hawa. Confidence, simanya, eh, eh, experience, self-expression, eh, asobulo ukuogira katimbasu gaba antu, she can actually, she knows the flow of the words, ufuna umu teka mpositivity, umu gumia. But, psychologically, this girl is going to be affected. Because any female, as far as Islam is concerned, the more, the more you disclose to many men. It devalues you as a girl. And a pious lady. Just you tangira tangira koko. Do you even know that even when a, a lady is mad, inga mula lu mboya zaabu uka. Just wapua yamba de burunji. Ni wabanga yamba de wimu chafu chafu. Na ita ku stage ya boda. Wallahi la uvimu. At least one or two men will talk about that lady. Wachi di veda bide ubulalu uwe. Para niko muku biobu fana nyeti. Wachi watianga simu lalu. Are you getting the point? Fengo sila mbuga mati neda. Wabango mchala wa febuwa chobu ali. Let, let us respect this lady. Even in the dressing code. 
Eh nyambala jimwambale it's it, it's protecting you to keep your respect as a girl Neka tuli musinge tuvuga nyo speed sincerely speaking Eh gwacho yambale impale Give me a reason I'm not being judgmental okay Nchimanyi muzambala ne gwacho jambala publicly Na kamugo kewandi kwese bao na kategera yeka no katwala ebweru babeli of fact him there is no one that is 100% beautiful even when you're having a good figure you're convinced even when you're too aba brown be balunje nyo ba chocolate be balunje nyo oba badaka even when your dark beautiful this beautiful darkness this way nga we no mbirigo na guli balanced the same color wallahi la vin there will always be that one factor someone is to consider to disrespect you a simple example do you know what it means to put on a back show momosano omunji and someone is seeing into your your sweats mugongo wano that's too nasty kumchara Someone is seeing into you. Ezikuva mu mutoro kati mbotade ko jasaka ganka. Omusana ola kwa munji. Nezikirira into you, nezikito ina katambala nno. Nezikirira into you down in your top. And someone is seeing that that's too nasty. Oli muchafu muntu gwe. But when you're putting on your hijab, we are going to see the face. You're beautiful. You're going to match bio bi sebyo na. I know bidaba ya I know bidaba ata ina bidaba atute chwani cha kongolo this is a beautiful lady and the fact still stands you will never be beautiful okuja kongo wachi de ntambula bagena jikubea and you will never impress all men kwa je cheche chikira racha aba aba bamba langa bala you going to put on makeup nga munji buzibu Waliwo msajja agenda kumwagala. Waliwo msajja kati nganze. Simanyi lwachi na enzo mtu kasayi wake ebintu ebinje ebyo. <laughs> simu bobi banai simu bobi mutekeke ebintu bya mmwe. Ate nchimanyi sirinze ka. Nchimanyi sirinze ka. Kumanze back into my mind I'm like. Oli mulunji nti yes ndi mulunji. Ne make up oyo. If you are Do you need that whole exaggeration of eh not take go now like I ne mutya ko buno buko eyelashes why go be na mu binyo to the extent into kale o te ko no buko we ko we subhanallah o baba na o ba nsi yendi mu ye nanka na nieta go mu chando za nga mwogezi mulunji to convince me that she is beautiful with all that Seta kumfira ku live at eyo. And the Islamic stand is you don't have to exaggerate that. Take a ka kantu akangu. You don't exceed even when you're making up. Katwangu yamba dine ijabwe urunji. Tochi susanga we kolako. You basically do that. Kubanga bo chi susa. Ogena kuyingira mbantu Allah we yagamba dhalika adna alla yurafna. When you follow the guidance of Islam, no tochi susa. Eh? That's the least you can do in order for people not to position you amongst the nasty kind of ladies. Kadi sebo yo convinced into rock bo mwana yamba de kamini mwala hmm ali ku TV atambude bweke binyira bwati bwakaza bweke nyura bwati bwakaza mkata ali comfortable eh bwatula ku bora na nyonya katinate ayamba de mnini atatula ku boda ngachi sajja chokabo bwatu la bwati nga ngatatu denga musajja echo nacho chiri dangerous kuba e e what like what kind of life is that gutola banga gu muslima wa fe wakaijabu cafe eh na kakaya cafe you just too simple eh no tula kaboda ko nechi tibwa chyo oli mulunji no kuba ka cafe ko kalabika ayagalo kulabo bulunji abulabye and who convinced ladies today into to show your body mkato uli katali bagenda kuwa samango are you sure the more you show the body the more they marry you 
aren't you even aware that when a guy sees any part on your body, a chochoka, it isn't enough for them. The fact that he is done seeing the kagere, he will want to see something else that is beyond a kagere. Mpaka bwakulaba wenna and the fact stands bwakumaliriza wenna asobola no kwagala okufuna obweta abo kulaba omuwalo omulala even with the fact that you share the same body parts. So muwala bwategera ebintu ngebyo dunia tekutwala speed. Veil ayagala okulaba ala bicha ino okulaba wabata kwagadde agende it is okay bayagala okuname eh hey. Ndinda bawe kaya bakulaba na yese bogena ko tani ko ko wegeza konti walinga mwero emabega kuba bakulaba da kabili konanga kaddugavu ka tese bofunye ku sente konna konna kero fenna twakulaba nti wali muddugavu katugena kula bila wadda oli wa ijab tugena kula bila wa eh era face wedu wa at least tufuna weku tukuteka nti omusana munji face inenge lije koze echi kombe ndi oli ku kizibu cho nayenga munno ye kaya chimanyi I think that makes sense. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala revive that respect within all ladies. Hmm? Of course, as we are trying to say this all, it doesn't mean that tubakaka, we are forcing you to now start the eating up, blah, blah. I know even tomorrow you're going to keep putting on the trouser maybe and so on. It doesn't seem to be. 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 It doesn't seem until you're losing na yefa abala ba we are not losing anything kubanga mbantu abakula muri mu abakula banga bakula biladala we bati na oba abakula banga bebu zabuza nenga akula bya no abira ona agenda okula bolumu aleme ko zayo aho bonna bala bibali aho bakulinze kat the moderate position is you are going job yo oba akula bya rumu bye bimu bya twala oba akwetegereza era bye bimu eh yes oba omuntu akula babwati Ngamutufu ya mba debubi. Kwa ya mba debubi. Na jayuma angama aso. Nataya gala umulavi kuhuja kusuara. Nwa baka gendo kukulava. Ngane unamulavu wote ila jakusikia. Za kumbu hati ingi ilakulavi. Akulavi. Apo na po jebali. Atale akungene naka gamba kakuwe mula au. Na ingu wali mwala. You're young. Tuweta ka mtu ku disrespectinga. You're claiming. But we chitiwa. But we chitiwa. But we chitiwa. Ngamwe kenyini mwamba la bubi. Eh? And you find some Muslim as putting on nice deal bubs. Nayenga bulichimwe chili munda. It is well seen. Ayamba deja bute tuganye. Ntono onzibu. To the level. Nti even engwe zo munda zo yamba de. Mapu ya zo yela vikebwero. Na uvanga ata yamba de sincerely speaking. Katimbo uloku ba ijabu mpamvu. It is making sense to you to touch in your hijab within your inner clothings. No kwata jiribabu, no jingiza, murugwe iluwa munda. No tamblandi, you're fine. And when they ask you that, eh, wayamba de jiribabu, tine jamba de tonda banga mthaidi nzi. Wathaidi nzi kweli. Au unu inamu kuyamba kaya galo kukubiyamu kufana nye. Gala, eh, wati wajida bwati, wati wajida bwati, mchalo mkulu utaize tayamba la bwati. So Islam is like to wrap the whole dramatic stuff. Please keep your respect. Islam respected you. We don't need to edit any principle in Islam. The respect that Islam gave to you is just enough for you. With respect, with respect. Please, at least let any factor that will take away that that, that respect from you. Allah alam bisawab wa barakallahu fikum i think let's pray and then to la boba wali waina cha yongereza kwanchi manyi muli bamanya abali wana barakallahu fikum wa salamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh today it's gonna be a life i love you tomorrow i miss you the third day it's going to be a touch the fourth day outing in a rainy season ku weekend with gwera kwa mwefunye wechi gwera ku weekend but if one gets to the opposite of that paisa no mmoje lega msajja watu do you know how many men are being 
like convinced to believe that they are less of men just because of the ladies they are having? Do you know how many ladies are being convinced that they are less ladies just because of the guys they are having, the husbands they are having? I want you to imagine a girl who is having that experience of sleeping with four guys. You date for one week, weekend in Gachigua. Because he might not call you at night at Ted Dobozing, Ayogera Valga, just like you used to. Akubo already attended. It's a mismatch. Nothing like a peck. You're convinced. 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 you they claim they need a virgin girl, but when a guy is having that experience, that is a total mismatch. Na yebu hati, ajia kwa galo mwe 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 tobi manyibi haku we mwe, obi yigide wa. You're innocent. Ajia kwa galo kwa zi sevi nitu, gubi utalabanga ko. Yabi labi yelabi ye. We are talking of someone who is intentionally sleeping with different ladies, ngayagala kulaba. How are they? A Muganda, a half casti, a Manyankole, a Mutiga, they want an agenda. Passage of a town. Osala Swala Chignavo to meet that demand. Are you sure you're self sufficient to battle with that unknown five ladies? Bota man. Who gained a college? Who gained a move for Bida? Ogena kufumbira kubuliri. Ogena kufumbira mungkuba. Na hingu batu linga na wachala. Bota manjina kumanya. So think of that in that broader picture. Mbumutu jerege ila. Obusilamu. Obusilamu. Obuli too strict. That is what we, we see in a bigger picture. And that's why edda ufumbo wali inga mwangu. Miaka kumina munano mwana anga. Tasawala kuchebe ila. They put them in marriage. Because they never considered fornication as a deal. Today, nyabo, oli mkweka liza miyaka jabi ni mwetana, asato ugeendelela. Tolo oza, angana kucha musajia. Because you know deep down, you're getting the service somewhere else. The same applies to a guy. Tebagala kuwasa, because they're having the service elsewhere. If it wasn't in play, you would be married. Mwenanga mwini mafumbu. Ate wandiko zechi. But you know there is this number now. Goge no kubi wogu kubizi, otemwe dogo zao, kabe kabe mwao, kuwikenda ji. Mukobe program. Mukolevi haba fumbo, na inga temuba wako wa fumbo. Katu wa fumbi luweji. Muta nise nukule tiraba to believe that marriage is hell. Since when? It is never hell. Just wako wako sivu waliwe wabu fumbo wabu uba au. Bako le mistake sivya, yu uba 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 au. It doesn't mean that marriage is hell. Never will it be. If you follow the Islamic guidance, even before you get someone, ogena kunyumiro bufumbo, sitiwa chochi sigaza, dhano kutuka, wanto mutu wakuwa siza, kucharocho nanga waga ambanti, no, ainaba sanji beba, ne kumbaga kuwebali. Wabayise, kucharo. Kato msaji avude, javude, takulide kucharo kwe. Do you know how, techi nyuma, and if this man gets to know that, abantu bano bali babaddeko nawe. Era mu babunze wunza awo ngatapate gedde. If they get to know that you're such a kind of lady, aina basanje we baba tolinga nabonga tamanyi. Bagena kulekee wamu. Yeah, bagena kulekee wamu. May Allah grant us is but we have a lot to do in today's era. Please be, be part of putting the society back to morality. Yeah, of course I know I'm speaking to young blood, my fellow youths. 
tomorrow, we are going to be the parents who are going to have grown up daughters and sons. Eso sa tebe wede. Boku zizo mwana ulunji, mwana wo mwala ngali innocent. Afune mulenzi munenga bali innocent we bati. Sababu la belenga tu went together. I think I'm making sense out of this. Eh? This is another approach of telling you stuff. Na tuna baba na baga manti Allah gena kocha mu abenzi bla 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 bla. There are some other factors zigendo kuluma ngo yingi do kufumbo na there is no solution to them paka ngawe feel it all you have to do is to be patient ngate wali njawulo ngate wali ngibera yonna yonna one one fact nsina ba kumali ngamali zenge na kuchibuza icho kubi a female body is conquered a male body conquers when you sleep with a man illegally outside marriage they are conquering you as a female and what a man is doing you're being conquered and a man is conquering you afuna matwale am i making sense or i have to explain that more When a man sleeps with a lady he is not too much affected as the way this lady is affected atene guja bagira no matira gwede you now a property of this man the last thing you need to think of at least let that man be your husband but the problem is letting your body get conquered a attachment is natural that's why you even have statements like first cut is the deepest eh? that's a fact because this is someone who is introducing you to the world you you don't know you will never forget that so i need you This is someone who is going to come after him. Because your body is already conquered to him. And you're faking its presence to the second one now. Nene kageza kakata na ata kola bibi ya kola. Olongojerega. Msajja watunga azungira mu makerenda na azungira kumbe gwe buziba. Naye nga yali nnomo. Abe kupanga afunye nnomo munne. Obolya obyandi tambude. Ni kwenu kula baba mu business bunji bunji awo nywa boti oyoche nywa boti ojire boti nywa bocho teka mutesi mu mazi toteka musukali unonywe and people are busy are busy to the level that even an innocent couple e tanda ba ku practicing biology a lady omusajja omuvubuka he has not yet even went in with this newly wedded wife he is busy buying some habos tana bana kumanya chicha agenda mu it's like he is training himself nti teta gana kusoma just because i nacha kirizam ndo yachira be walala kacha chigena kula ni kwani ni kugwe but is that a fact just because some lady echimukolera che chino does it mean that it chikolera allah to went again that is what i believe in and it's not as a result of my emotions it's as a result of the deen i'm in the islamic deen i'm in i believe you should also employ maybe adopt to that eh? so it's not all about virginity it's more of the morals and that's why allah was like wa hurrima dhalika ala almu'minin the believers who use their senses to reason logically they will never fall victims in such funny funny dramatic situations sallallahu alayhi wa sallam marila finna allahumma amin the second question what is behind these motivational speakers in you should move out of campus wetege nsomye nsomye butufu eh actually i think this is a nice question 
Kumanga, our young Muslim girls are being like distracted. Society is busy trying to train you. Busebo nyabo watu boga no kuetega, bomutu futajia kujia. Mwalimu chuli dekecho, mukato ino kuero ana kwe, kanga kwa malimu wa hantu mwe. Okuetega, eh? it's the last level any lady needs to get to. Oba we wa deko obu julizi, nti yo too bad, yo too worse, that no one can identify you at a low profile, chosiga za choka, weruane kukunama mwe weruawo. Have you ever thought of it in that way? That will never be a factor. Someone who will marry you, teleta galaba chisambijo. No. Actually, that's why Islamically, it's the unseen that encourage someone, encourages someone to marry you as soon as possible. If you provide them what they are supposed to imagine and miss, when a man wants to marry you, they will need to marry you. You don't service them before that. After you service them, go mazoku bawa, chiche yesunga after marrying you. You give them a reason to marry you, and thus keeping your low profile with your beauty. Of course, the ideal situation is, this Muslima has to be morally upright, well behaved. It has nothing to do with beauty, actually. For your information, Islamically, we discourage a man to marry a lady concerning only beauty. You're beautiful. But if you want to know that you're not beautiful, try being immoral. Kunama, wemura. Yeah, but you are beautiful. But no one will want to have you as a companion. The least they can do for you to deal with you, bakumaleke wagazi wa sexual desire zao, uirengo ulifaini, na ingu usiga de, telia kutonguza. Ila katiba nubojile gabeta, abate ete gabla, bla, bla, baba ya, baba, laba. And they know what they want. They are like, huh? Mwano yunze mwulavye, mpisa zinzi lavye, prophet went to an extent to be like, la tankihun nisa, the Jamali Hinna. Men don't dare marry ladies blindly considering beauty. And Imam Shafi'i was like, discouraged a man to marry a lady who is extremely beautiful because of what they believe in. Because today, when we are seeing it today, Omwala Yedida Kuwana Figa Nunji, Nata Kunama. Bize ni muhijabu ya fekati. Mwala ya kulaburunja alhamdulillah. Nuga ma alhamdulillah yebisi. Na hini hijabu na agena na ajituwala. Never ji baka fitting. Nisi gaza justi. Nti ayamba de hijabu na yenga. You're seeing the whole body structure. And then we are like okay. Nisi kwetu wede tede. Young girls of believing. But. Okwete goku. Sisu vila nitu wali wumu siyamu, ali upright. Nga mbutufo yinan, o ine mpisa zo. Nga weta ago kwe tega. To chisawida nga na Allah kutosa kuleve. That's a level of being desperate. Ya, obanga genze kubano onya. Nja ulo zero. Jaso richa bako wako kanyide konta, aliku TV na kamera. Nguoli wano kuchitumu baba. Kwa kula chi. Bakula ba. Salallahu tuwe ntegele. I don't think I'm making... Am I making sense? Yeah, it makes sense. I know it does make sense. But whatever I'm trying to say out, I'm not trying to... Kumalamu maanyi, kutongu zeko umu lino, tikati wadlahi o wede, wekikia mao togona. But I know, the fact that you are alive and I'm here, it's not by mistake. Maybe Allah has made this talk from me to you, for it to be a starting point. So, 
with Dawla. And it is possible. And that's why Allah pardoned a lady and a guy who is having this funny background in the true sense of repenting. Because with repenting, it consists of whatever you've been in. Because of course you know now that it's bad. You promise not to intentionally fall into it. And then lastly, you promise Allah that you're done with everything. Yeah, that one guy, Amara, start a new chapter. It's going to be hard to get to a new version of you, but try it. It will be a new version of you. Don't do this. experience. I think it makes sense. Eh? May Allah pardon us all. Of course, no one is perfect in that line, but we try our level best eh, to be perfect so such, such that in a broader picture, our society is nice. Barakallahu feekum. Tukura example ya buwe, muka nizanti buli nya diya bagara na eh? Buu, uri wa shito samunga gamba bu bu. This is now a couple, eh? Omusajja no mchara. Omusajja bamu itabu. No mchara bamu itabu. Ababe. 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 <laughs> eh, maabi ya ulana wabuti kato omusajja yebu, omchara yebe. <laughs> Na yenga gweba itabu o babe, eh? Tafu nangayuku kasera kuno onyeleza. Buono chivawa. Hmm? Kwa hiyo wao wao some some ideology au kale bo no kale twage no chere zanti bo chiri kumpi ne chigaba we chiti ne chichala ko ne chibera bo au guma ndi bana bampisa echi ne kati ye ne yakole nso bina gamba bo oba yali asinzira kuchi ye kaya amanye nsonga fituru wano zibuzika aba bo and bo eh ne nze sa kale Agamanya agata tege kaburunji, eh? Kali munga koze siga gana, si mabi? Kasari wanga mne muna ama tide, niti ye buvo, eh? Na ye, eh? Wari wa manya amalalala. Ngo mtu osobolo kubuga mba akanya, mbutufu na manyanti, akanya kasi nzide, no mnyo nyo kumunyo nyola. Allah ika nkawa we. One day, eh? Prophet, yaline haa isha mchala we. How is your love? How is my love within you? Onjagala chen kanachi. Nabi kwe kufa mwa kagambo. Ti hubi laki. My wife Aisha. My love for you. Ka uqdati lhabli. It's just like. Bajita notch. No it's not a notch. Not. It's fundi kwa. It's just like. A knot in a rope. Oh, you know, because of ya. Kati nkakasa. Nkakasa ante mutegede. Kati nkakasa ante mutegede. Kati nkakasa ante mutegede. Ate ya umuguwa. No umuguwa nubi kwa taga nilawa. Nabi kwe kumwenye nyola. Nti ngabu wola ba. Echifundi kwa. Chiba ite echifundi kwa. Chiba chinywe de. Ngo kuchisu mula. Chizibu. Kati nga nabiyari nga agami mchala we. Ngeri jen kwa gala mchala we. The difficulty you face as you're trying to loosen the knot. Gemanyo mtu geyetaga wabaya gala ndikira kwa gala. Iraa isha china jukirwa. Ntibu ya kola angamu buwati. A week ina itawo. Ngabuza na binti kaifa halu lukda. Kati echifundi kwa chidi chiche sawe. Na binga agama anti hea kama hea. It's like chidi ingawe chidi. Chidi ana kusetuka. Ngada muama chidi. Olama mkwanu ugwa. Kati hai shamulia tege dan tu. Mamu wanyi echifundi kwa na inga tege de. Echifundi kwa chemistry ya mamu nyonyode. Hey. Na hei mubela kaku. Bela kukurieti unawe. Hey. Wachili omutu omu ita anti sweet. Hey. Neka tena sui ne suiti, o suiti o muri dedi, o tole o sinzi de kuchok te kila nta wom. Ah, what by the way, amadha haboga malaga gano. 
ndoze omuntu kwa sinzira kuita omuntu sweet kubanga sweet abawo makati muri abasubira ne munono omuntu ali kind hearted sweet hearted eh ndoza kwa kumuita sweet yes ensonga ngayo kati bankuru kati abantu mubano nyiza amazi dangago sweet sweet heart eh mm omunya mubuyina eh Osano kuchusa ko kunimi wale okate nimi ezili romantic na baba ni nimi ezitali chichi sebo katolie yoloza your local language tosaba kujamu kanya no bukira abazungu jojo obunya eh no buku no buku bamunno eh ndoza ne kanotu kajukire nga tumalirize echo obudenga buwedde ocha we buzo nga bibiri ne kanotu kajukire nabade ne bayizi bangawe makere na wa service and i was like Tumi chiso sanya ate mkwe itamanya. Mugarekele viva ino gaita. Kata gereke. You don't demand a name from someone. You just deserve it. Hey, mtu wabata na kutatana wa kufuwa kwa linyali ya kuwa. Tonyi gache katona wa bela gudu kusana. Nchitegede. Nadala mkwe yogereza wano. Ya tebaba fera nyo kubanga kata wabasaja mbata endese nyo bawa nizala niza waneno wakube wakao byo kuwana byo ebyo no bya bafumbo ndo ogambo cha sweet heart ogambo cha bu na yakati right now it's the opposite munyo miru omukwa nubwa ne myaka eja olukone wakabwoti elinya ile chikale bivayo atelika kakutando omunyizemu ngali yao awo kati ye past owedde ngatanika kuita linya lya mwana waso kati linya lya linya lo lya chika kuba anonya wakuteka wa mangu kati nga fegatu ka mbusulamu no 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 don't 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 temu te baba vuga speed eh ya wakuita ngeri nya bwedi tyo mu wike soka really wafu said be sweet heart wo mtu mu wike soka only one ka week i'm much so no chiso like today ne mukanya kati mutani relationship you're dating now islamically of course we ring about dating ngamba ngamba islamically si bine bya mu kuma chao amanya amalunyi negatandikira otoina na osinzira kuita muntu linya dunji muita linya lyenti mutyaba ugamba ki na ya kuita linya lyo mutisumaya muina che mukola chi bintu bya serious kati what you mwezi gugweka wo omyezi ebiri nga ina wasinzira kulabye mu oli muntu mulunji oli muntu naka goita street hati ye muntu ataina muchisa mote magu goita street hati ye muntu anyiga nyige nyo you doing injustice to the name ye yalitandika obwa kuli lango oli muyita akusu winga hmm? i think you're getting the point eh? barakallahu fikum nendo za yuzo ngachi mo baba bibili oba eh oba bye obyo kabye tuba tusembyayo hmm wa ma alayka illa albalagh our role as muslims is to deliver the message as soon as you're done delivering the message whatever they do the aftermath of after the deliverance biliko bo gogugo bo gumaze and even prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam he was guided lasta alayhim bi musaytir just deliver the message you don't dominate them allah guides yes karamutu labanga gomu guidinga you try to guide them not your approach nunji aizo kubanga ali big headed we bali abantu bali big headed kuba butonno ngani muzadde we wallahi this is a fact ngenkuza ye ya mutwe munene avubuse wa mutwe munene ngagukolera ne kubazadde be eh kati chechi kuleta ndi kati msemo nzenze ze Hussein msebo just this one hour mbunku chuse a a this is like expectation yange nze nkola gwange ne manyata a afunye mwe cho kuiga kolechi atafunye mchi akuyiga nzo gwange kukoze echi guwedde eyo discipline kasojete kam abantu babanga nako gutusa chicho erabe batakulumia eh msebo mugambi asale na kuita konga agenda mbilala ngate gojja kusala wano mbunonyi go lumidwa nyo ah ah muleke gwe mugambi ntwa eswala jeri eh boye changa changa bwa atenga bla 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 oyine byo kola nawe jango bikosale odeyo nayo byo kola chi gogo bo gukoze echi laitoka masoga allah ma yepa nkanga ibata mugamba nga allah mulaga tosaga 
bakugamba wawulira notakola chi kati nawo ali wanongo ali wa mutwe munene ngaba kugamba ko sebo notawulira eh ne we yete ne nolita ne aya ne hadisi to please don't judge me because islam never judges of course islam never judges ne bakula bo genda mu ndongo nga saa za swala bakula bo genda mu bintu bilala nengo budde bwa swala swala ko nawe malaika zikukeko o chuse chuse muko o manyeto inoku nda kuchi ku right track wa barakallahu fikum mm. to what extent about a muslim partner bad <coughs> what do they mean by partner audio like <laughs> this girl is now dating a non muslim guy yeah kali chuo zitika machi tia what extent eh bad ah they are already bad kasa ba bali mwana ni mwana it's true that's already is an extent hmm? i want a simu bubi eh we have no leeway for our muslima to be inferior to her superior who is not a muslim is clear eh? actually ideally tuba tusubira anti muri we bintu bitaita kana debate gayo muslimu munno ali practicing ngibe bya default ejo chuchi kya bulijjo okutandiko mbulo woza ako ba confusing your public now i know kubanga already musaze musiram kati ngo yili bana bine bila social Ayatia tambla tanaba is he disciplined e what byo yilibana byo ne bisoke bwako boundary line musiramu ali practicing chechi muno muvubuka muchala ali practicing omuchi omusiramu i think it's clear eh? because we, ha- we don't have that marriage is not allowed you don't even allowed to date a guy who is not who is not a muslim bwa siramu ka alhamdulillah wa ba siramu se sincerely alhamdulillah kubanga kisoboke dalala okusiramu ka nga yagala kuwasa nyake ebili yao nga abana bali basatu ne munyiga mwao goli ku dini ya nono na chusa mwao na daye wabo kicha sobokera dalala tubira byeko eh hey, so at least mungu wa kusasira na banga asira musinga bya dalala asira muse kiba kirungi ne mutandikirawo ne bwa banga agani a ah, osira mna mujje bali eh hey? yes basira mujje bali mufumbira basira mu Eh omo agala kunga mante balabika eh je bali je bali mu bajja kulabika insha Allah Due deo eh wali wa ne chibozo Mm that's a very good question okuchiva ko sigama anti mugamba lero ngo nini ayo chiva ko anti ha kasam mugamba a a actually it's not how close is someone to you eh bona bela ngo limukwano gwange nga nkulabo waba we ku byemizimu bita tegerekeka mukugamba ko lero approach ewe gana nga nonya approach yechi eyo kubiri apo cheye kubiri wegana eyo that's how creative someone who calls to good why no kubera bwabera sister wo mukuru wo oba mutowo bwabe mukuru wo by default walwo specific ways ezo mu approachinga bwabera mutowo by default walwo engeri jo mukola chi yo mu approachinga bwabera mukwano gwo ne walwo kale mutu kubanga just stranger stranger kadwa bera kat for example mutabani oba mutabani oba mutabani wange oba muwalawo unai na weye tumutandikire nunga akula eh kadna yawa numi omtu woyo mutabani wa ingwenza denga akula bwati ya discipline ajifuna ko yaji akula ne oba ne bano ba stranger hm aze no mulaba konga mutufa yamba de bubi no muita mu Burundi like na sister 
ngo kuna myebwoti na avamu ogugambwa ogukusukakanya nga gwambo ki hmm? ai ainzo kugamba ntia yu goroza gwe mutukirivu hmm? kugamba yo nawe bibyo byokola ulate tubimanyi ainzo no chikugamba echo nkumanyi nawe ine chi cha mchokola nchikugambe chikugambe mugambe ane dato chingamba nange nchikola nenze kasangu koze echi aba stunya te bakumaira nga budde mu discipline elimu mmanyi bachi nba wa discipline eyo people who are immoral bagala nyo kubera abalunji nga you reminding them nebera bila boge nnyi okwejukiza to be good after being told who told you nyabo oba sebo just because i know islam just because ndi seka mbuka tinyabo eh mfuka meno fuka mira nkabe kugwe stranger nkamfachi nino muri mogo kola na family yange na relatives bange na ba brothers bange nina that's why even allah when allah is trying to guide ku anfusakum wa ahlikum nara mweke nyini mweta so mulido and your relatives be basoka even the prophet where that and katani kan family be abu boba numa bwenda ba sister wange nga tagala apiranga numa neka to stranger ekitono yowandi ba demokwano gwange nnumirireko kwao nito ina mukwano gwange nkula byako jas mundu gusoka mbo nnumya a a bwen kugamba ko bugambi wano bobo yagala no pickinga boba to yagadde nga nchusa ko na approach endala mungu bwa sasira no chuka alhamdulillah bwe we fira nga to chusiza atenze bana nnenye zachi nze nakukola chi nakugamba byo nabyo no yili bana byo gwe nga gwe sababu watu we discipline ndo zangeziza ko to moderately play with it eh? yes eh yeah. Now actually islamically that's a good question islamically there is no specific period you know mala choba one year over two years echi dictating obudde kwe kwe manya ebili basic bawe echi okulabira ko omuvubu kabwa je uwo ye yaba amazo kola background check ye he believes no busobo za abuyina and surprisingly today not everyone that says i love you tabaya gala kuwasa be conscious about that naje uwo nawe no mudiza now we are like mutanze okola chi ngo muwala you have a lot byo ino kuyiga ku mvugo kono byo gendo gumirako to give a hand in marriage che chimu no mvubuka period ya time ene yoku datinga oba mwaka oba chi ya kubanga abantu bano bakola chi bategeeragana not to delay even with the ability of getting married when a guy is like i love you today we don't encourage them to marry you tomorrow am i making sense just like we don't encourage him okuluisa woku kola chi okuwasa we encourage him to utilize the time jimu ine entono mwetegere ebili basic mulawo bamuna atambula wibate mu tambule bigwe with respect omulalaje oneme ku mono nira budde am i making sense echo kulabira ko do you know an introvert do you know an extrovert introvert ye muntu nganyumi bakubera yekka si mu bubi that is them anyumi bakubera yekka kasita kutane yegaira mu kisenge ngaina data wene simu ye 
temu ina chemu mugamba agenda bero mu kase nyumba ri self contained a week egwenga taforomye afuruma kola shopping a demo akole chi that's an introvert it's a personality no be on extrovert ye ye dira chono oluna ku erugwa nga tafunye mukwano mupya auli langa takoze bulungi bwagenda okuyingira bwa fenna tufuke mikwano je musida chikaga na amazo kutegera anti ono wawa nono wawa nono alibwa tu akube mbozi wano tumukole chi oye extrovert i want you to imagine obufumbo bwa introvert ne extrovert ngate bachi realizing before got into marriage bogendo okuulira omuchala bwa banga introvert nga nyumira kubera yekka ato omusajja extrovert ye omusajja jja kubaloza anti muchala wange nna kubera naye buli wantu ne ku mikolo jjo kwanjira na akutwala ne mwe ndo vinana ba akutwala ba afuruma ke bweli kuduka ogende na yemu kumbe bikuba wate gwe gwe yakala kubera wa waka but if you learn that before that's why dating is there al khitba surprisingly we waste time as we are dating one mukola chi ku cafe jabaz what business is there eh at least eh oba nkubye nyo nenda che ngamba otandiko ocho genda mu cafe jabaz in one month ngatona na kutegera muntu ono ebi as bisembe yelinga musi kumpi kugenda kati mu bofumu kati mu msajja amanyi o o cafe jabaz wiki yesoka ota mutwala o o leka nawe you have a lot to deal with what what background check bao akuli demo family chi do you want to get married to a husband material atagambu ako gwe bakuziza anti gwe oli musajja sajja ata musajja wafe mvuka wafe akuze alaba mama wate ka ya amazi mushawa ne nyumba baina shawa wo mune cold mwegali ne mama ate ka yo amazi mukadomola mukinabiro mbubuko yo wakuzala ba akuzala ba mama we ajja mutata we socks akuzala ba mama we are talking of a 25 year old eyo cha kuzala ba that's the world kuye Yemvubukalo was anti I'm going to marry a wife who is going to do the same. Just because you're having nice memories, eto no chera bila. Umuyingira mbufumbo kati mbu you're less a woman kubanga to mujje mo socks mochi. Mubigere. Am I making sense? Bo bitegera wano mu dating omanya tisisobodde oli tradition onyo. Tujja kusobola kuba to tradition onyo. I think that's that's a point. Nese bo ba musayi muto bali wano ba malo budde Atenga wallahi binji nyo ndo tusembye no point get but sembye ayi binji nyo byo take doctor ka kesira as your dating okusinga be malya ko budde wallahi la ovim ukaka saweta go musajja ngatai nayo authority muri wakuru kumugamba ko someone you're going to discuss with Omugambe bawo no kati kuyogera naye. Omugamba naye kati bawange. Bwenja galo kuba akone gwenjogera koko na ye. About you. Na kugambira wo. Nyabo. You don't talk about me. Siku tata wange. Bagana ngetoba gamba kubiki mwatako. I'm one man ame. Nze byange bikola chi. Die malira. Ye bawo. Wumutu atu ala time ya dating inu Mumalabu de and Echisinga no kun surprisinga You waste time in doing haram stuff Ato bufumbo wumu ingira mbufumbo Nemujanja wazao kumukolo Fetuba linza after a month Ngamuli mbufumbo Mwesa wako no nyaba walimu Pudia kula bika ngomu walimu Omu ingize mbintu Ama mba wangali wangali wati Mwa mba wangali wati You had time to check all that Wane ema bega Nika tiyo yobawu Achukugambi dena wanti nze tewali wanga ambako. Do you know a husband? Ngani tata wita sobula muga ambako. Ono unya musajja wakufumbirwa. Ngo ubaida bubi nyo kugenda kumusajja angoyo. Do you know a husband? Ngani baganda we. They can't talk to him about something. Akuzatia. Are you getting the point? Ona dugira wa. Bogeno mubo zanti kata aha seka usai ni ye seka wange mugambe ko bagendo kugamba nkugana tata atonde tira usaini 
ngogumira mu bufumbo bwo ngaba kubagwe ngaba nyoma gwe nabana bonosigaza kimwanti kati mwachifula ngombo kangume kulwa abana noguma nabana abo mpaka wewefira na yenga you disrespected mbula muwo bwo bufumbo je wandi je wandi yagalide don't waste time as you're dating nze nchibagamba nyo you don't waste time as you ebyokolo ina binji as you're dating okusinga bi mumuloza bi muino kola ni work plan ni mujikuba ezimu ku nsonge ziletira abantu okulwawo nyo nga badatinga it's because of the fancy life we jimba mwagala nga mudatinga and wallahi la alvin many men majority of men are having that fancy life with girls nga baba datinga wave materials basajja batono nya baina discipline ebikolera bachala babo we mutwe mutwe ndese kati abasajja kuba mwa baba vuga umusajja uya nenso nyo kutambula ko ne mchala ko na abana tuno tumani tuma na kuche tumaze na kuchekinga what's your view musajja gwe mu mbera ngeno come on you have a lot to do okumanya abantu boko lachi okutegeera obutegeezi kokka reasoning okakasa your husband to be ategeera nga omwetaago okutegeera do you know what it means to be a wife kumusajja gwosinga okutegeera ngata aina masculinity ye nti omusajja is a man nga yagena no kugamba nti abachala temutegeera fa basajja tukola chi Omanyo bulamu do you know how psychologically you going to be tortured mumbera nge ngagwe muchala ngavuga family yo wakanya nja magezi gali eno ya ali eno no tachifana ko olwo kuba seba inaka sente olwo kuba ku obulabo labo olwo kuba kutwala mufo bulunji echo no chimma amazi and after marriage you tandiko kuzungira zungira mbantu banai 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 mu mwaka gumu after bufumbo na yo muntu bwa bwa considering ngeyo byo nabyo na as soon as they feel they are ready nga basics bazitegedde nga pateba li ready nga nike ekola chi eruma nikabwe eruma muge no kuyingira mu bufumbo nga ebyandi koze nga mawulire wono mwa bidiringa mudda bo manya ndi musajja wali tradition oba we setting adda ndi ze kankanyigo akutwala mazi mochi bo manya ndi musajja oba muchala wange muyombi ngo rumvubuka ya muchala wange muyombi ya chingabira wonti muyombi nayi nasigala nawe kiba kitegeza nti we expect him okufuna methods ezo kudinga ne muchala wo muchi omuyombi we don't expect him to bring it as a complaint muchala wanga ayomba nyo wandi mulese nono nya atakola chi atayomba i think you're getting the sense eh? it is islamic style of dating ejawo nye ebizibu buli mufumbo bya kaba bwabanga ajje respectinze nkusubiza bota ajje respectinze bota ajje respectinga islamic dating eh? bota funa kukukaba mbufumbo onno nyanga you will definitely have to shed a tear sabala benenga tena mwena abawonya okshedinga tear obudde nga bujize ya rabbi eh tusembye sekati eh yes naam alaykum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh sultan wajib Mm. Aye tandiketi ya. Mm. That's the the story the story of the of Falut and 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 his army, eh? Unfortunately, I need to revise the story. I know it, but I don't want to make a mistake eh? in in translating the words of God. Because I know I know I know the impact of it. Eh? Ya ndozo ja konsonywa simanyo ba e kati mbange na chikudda mudinga nkomyewo inshallah inshallah saballah nsijukize ya of course i have something to say about it but I'm, I, I, i don't want to make a mistake ya yeah. and it's a discipline in knowledge toyogera kuchiyoteka kasa eh ya yeah. and i don't i don't even remember when did i last revise the story the the the, the, the story of palot and this army Mm. Kategori kese barakallahu fikum duwe deyo saballahu subhanahu wa ta'ala berenga 
you are over so get to my way to tea, then it's over chaff fena. To call it to Chava Nai, to Kriziba, Raja to call it to Okay, come in at the Zima Lava B. What do I get out to call it to Yao? Waka Mega? Ah, Magadi bin the Namwe. Here. Eh, to ask at your source, the Kudakon is sick at one, eh? Hm. My Salam of the Lamb of the It's a good question. A Rijalu Kawamuna and Nisa Alaya Gezako. Respecting a society's is a fair with providing them with leader materials. Within any society, we need someone who is positioned to decide good or bad. Katagede. Omosaja wa gamba rija luka wa muna ala nisanga gende demu kunyoma muchala. That's not the right literal meaning of that. But it literally means, but they are head and responsible of whatever will happen. Guess what? Even when you're married, no color, some funny stuff, eh? your husband is guided. And Allah made it a point to give a reason as to why the men dominate ladies. They are the providers. They provide to you. Nechita gezant, when a man doesn't provide to you, chiba chimujamu kube iru musajja, omutufu. Yeah. Katagiri kesako, eh? But it doesn't mean that gender balance. What do you mean by gender balance? Like, abasajja bebamu na wachala, eh? No, but it's not like that. A man is a man, and a woman is a woman, which is okay. These are two fields that we be comparing. The strength of a man is somewhere, and the strength of a lady is somewhere. Trust me, where a strength of a man is applied, or is applying our strength here, and where your strength is, Sagara na kumanyao. Njaga lukuze kubasajja wumanyi, and that's the strength of a woman. We are trying now to pull ropes. Eh? It's not unnecessary. We don't have to fill the air. We don't have to fill the air. We don't have to do it. We We do to Omusaja, oh, ato omusaja chiri wasi. Omusaja watali kwa kwe teleza. Nye tamu zango mchala. Nye jirango omusaja. Bo omchala. Bo yeyuki zango omchala. Echo na cho. Katemba mwiriri. So a man is a man. Which is okay. Kambuze yechi wuzo. The feminists are claiming of gender balance. Eh? They claim gender balance with positivity alone. They don't claim for that with bad stories. Okakasa, osobolo kusima toy, ya foot ya tan. Can you? Eh? Obo gende mujimu ufune kumanyo ujisime. Katiru wako wata sobolo kusima toy, ingatuka ama antoli munafu. No, of course you, we can't. Gwinao wa manyi uga ina yuga kola ji? Uga veda. Nange kenyini omosajia, omosimi wa toy, mzeni nange si chisobola ni. Nage no musajja, ainzo kubanga anjisima, mpaka atano futi ye. Wali uwe vye chichala visuwa na kuruwoza kukufuna. And that's how sweet nature is. Hey, jenso ngolachi mtanise no kuruwoza, just because omusaya basajja beba kanyo na wachala, mnawe kato utaniko kuhedi baga, weba kebote, kunebote, nebote. No, 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 we are affected differently. Engiri umbili gomusajja gwa affecti ingiwa, no kuweba kapaka na wasajja, that alone, because we are different. Anyway, 
Echo kaka sasa tunachi welcoming. We don't need to pull ropes. Eh? At least mumbele ya kumanyira. Omusajja taina kumanyira mchala lwa kuba ina cha musinza. Kuba strength yo musajja teko lawa. Teko la kusaidi yo. Nawe chechimu. Bulimonta ina just respecting a side. Ito musajja respecting yo mchala wenchi. Mchala wange. Bino vya nsingamu. Nena nge musinza chino. Na omanyete ya musajja wange bino vya nsingamu. Nde nange musinza wenchi. Then we move. Eh? Yes. Jenda bala sebele nge li keta difo. Eh? Mm. Na hii jenda bala nsinza njiwuli na nyuma office. Mm. Atenge misala mijimu. Sijiwu ya kuku basajja basitula na kawano. Basitula webi domo lao. These, these petty petty jobs now. Eh? Kuba matafali. O kakasa. Just because you're seeing a lady. Maybe she was tested. Mumbera ye, ensine mutuwa laje mutute. Na hako mekele zanga, alimu kuba, bricklaying, matafari. Eh? Are you sure? That's what you want to do? Just because of gender balance? No. But even when kumuchala anga akolo omulimu, eh? Okusila mbuga amanti, omuchala omulimu guwa ino kuba anga akola. Guteke do kuba anga respecting an nature ye. Yes. Uwebera muumeme, nga at least tolimu field kuwa la ampamiti. Olimu ofisi. Nga guwa sindi kaba wala ampamiti. Nga tuga amanti wakola. Eh? At least wabanga uli wamchi, wabela angu uli mujasi. Tetuaka kula kufront line. Yemu ya mubela yo. Soma. Yonge la visatificate ugendo obu yingile. Ngoli mwafi isi guwa sindika mugende wa. Mugende wa. Matuga amantu uli well positioned. Na yemu tansi wakula usanzi nawe muteke dog striving. Okadu uli wami akana. Kumbe wandi bade. Osigaro chari in place. Eh? Eh, Saba la belenga atu wente gere. Yabada semba. Mm. Eh. Hey. Gwaba, gwabu uziza. Eh? Oni abu uziza? Yes. Yoni abada asemba. Eh. Asinga chi? Asera. Wali ya makuru wa maloba chichitegeze. Like, like, babe edabu na, eh? Bete gera, eh? Mumulo zaachi Nga for example mama inabia teka mumere ya tata Nga chi Nga kare powder Oba nga African chemistry Mumulo zaako latia Atamia kutata Bwa mutemi nga yariamu Wadedaka African chemistry Nga agenda kukuba kukubi ate Wadaka kukuncha ya mama wo Ya nakuba Sabalu lari metu kwezi sana mnambeleze but I think, do, at least don't be part of that. Eh? Hey. To seda na mama umu angu yeyo. At least to seda na imu mbele ntufe. Eh? Hey. Na yeto seda na imu mbele yachi. Mbele yako, ya, ya kwe lo gila ateta atawo. Eh? Hey. To wandi ya gade tata ate muloge. Eh? Hey. Yes. Eh? Hey. Kumango obusida mbutu, obusida mbutu guiding anti. Anything to do with obeying parents. Chino kumango chili mlaini ya obusida mbutu. So you don't help them in line with this, this disobeying Allah. Yeah. Kata kiri sabulunji ya. Barakallahu fikum. Banai muwebale nyo. Muwebale nyo. Muwebale nyo. Oge na kuncha wanga siku kiriza. Oge na kuncha wa eh. Eh. Hey. Kari bismillah. Tukanyi bana yasimba. Bismillah. Alaikum salam. Yes, what I ask you? Could you ma not be a two guiding? Bobango took a masjid. You are your bid it a hair tunnel masjid. Bomariza, or you end a la bid. Quiet in Koreana being a salida canya, cobla, aljuma. Ati ya linka wankula ya nabingu ya mala nge juma. Ngata ebi. Tazi sali lawa. Masjidi. Ngata ambla nga zisali le waka. Yesu na yani. Ya nabingu. Katichingo bulunji kwa kukube ele nkule yo. Yes. Notuka masjidi. Na ati butuka nga imama atandise. Okolotia. Osala. Eh? Osala otia. 
Yeah. Angu nga imama aliku kutubaka ya tandi sa ina alhamdulillah Gwe no ingira wao okolotia Ouli vizao voe osala yao Eh? Osala? Eh? Abama, actually, eh, by the way, abama mm -hmm. Abama nyamu babu babu ya ukanamu Muni mama gama nti, ah, ya khe Ode do kere ye Ingira okolechi Matule Nyawa bagama nti ah bo yingira bwoti iwa yo bidi na yezi yuwe obu yito like oyangu yamu eh yes oyangu yamu awo kubanga oyina ekhutba jo inokola chi okuwuliriza yes bota sala bidi nga tozi sala mu mbera nga olinga agama nti oyina chikugoba ya yeah, kati either way either way kusinzira ku mbera jo jo, jo limu chinzo kola chi Chinzo kula. Wallahu alam bisawab. Mm. Kata kere kisabu runji ya. Eh? Mm. Barakallahu fikum. Thank you. Uh, this, is a, this is a week and well spent. Mm. At, at least Sunday yang sitomye. Temumbo ye. Kansubile na mwesiba boye. Sabu Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Bedenga atuwamu empeda. Sabu Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Bedenga finatu gaidinga. Amin, 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 ya Rabbi. Doza vye vyo. Tuwa hindi nga tutea mpunzi keye edi fomo. Kadua we. Audhu billahi minna shaitan al-rajim. Bismillahi r-Rahman al-Rahim. Alhamdulillahi rabbil alamin. Al-Rahman al-Rahim. Maliki yawm al-Din. Iyaka na'abudu wa iyaka nasta'in. Ihdina sirata al-Mustaqim. Sirata al-Ladhina annamta alayhim. غير المغضوب عليهم ولا الضالين ربنا يسر لنا ولا تعسر علينا اللهم يسر لنا ولا تعسر علينا برحمتك يا أرحم الراحمين ربنا آتنا في الدنيا حسنة وفي الآخرة حسنة وقنا عذاب النار ربنا زدنا علما ورزقنا فهما يا مقلب القلوب ولا بصار ثبت قلوبنا على دينك وعلى طاعتك برحمتك يا أرحم الراحمين وصل الله على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين والحمد لله رب العالمين آمين. I'm by names of Hussein Ali Bulaf. I'm a lecturer, Islamic University in Uganda. Embale, embale. I'm a Gishu by tribe. Eh? Eh? Dimundi, dimundi na Uganda. Nimogisu. Amuwa loza siri muna Uganda. Ndi muna Uganda wawan. Tata muna Uganda. Nima muna Uganda.